<clears throat> Hello, you guys. I hope y'all have an amazing day. I think I'm trying to use the same email as me. Hello, you guys. I'm about to do a zodiac energy reading, you guys. Tap the screen and show my video. Tap the screen <clears throat> and share my video. I'm gonna try to stay up here and do all the zodiacs, you guys. And if you want to skip some, skip the line, you can um donate. I'm starting out with the earth. Oh my god, it didn't switch, y'all. I'm starting out with the earth and then air, fire, and then water. I don't know why they got it like that because I went in and tried to change it, you guys, because I didn't do earth and air last time. So I hope y'all have an amazing morning. Or whatever time it is that you're watching this. Hello. Great day, you guys. Talk the screen and show the video. Hello. Hey, Latoya. I love that name, baby. It's something about the name. Toya, you hear me? Okay. It's something about our name. You hear me? <laughs> Hello, you guys. I hope y'all have an amazing morning. I appreciate you. I'm going ahead to get started. I would wait. I would wait, you guys. But I'm going ahead and get started for the Zodiacs. Because y'all know I get tired real quick doing this shit. It's so annoying. I'm trying to get my patience up. I hope y'all have an amazing day. So, Earth size, Sun, Moon, Rising. Take what rest day. And I always leave the rest Virgo. Capricorn. Who is on the Taurus? Virgo, Capricorn, and Taurus, baby. Hello. Okay. Y'all put yes, Libra. Okay. Great day. Queen. Y'all put y'all zodiacs in the comment section. If y'all donate, I'll be able to see it this time. Cause the other night I got off so goddamn quick. I was so tired. Yeah. That woman had something and got down cash out and she quickly requested that. Maybe I ain't want your money. Let me see you your money back. But I appreciate you. I appreciate you. I did try to wait around on you because I had when I seen it after I got off. And I was like, well, maybe she'll inbox me. If she inbox me, I go ahead and honor that. But she didn't. She requested that money with them little $12 right on back. And I sent it right on back to her, baby. Yes, ma'am. Clear my name up out that. Okay. Earth signs. How you doing? How you feeling? What the business is? Word on the street. They don't know how to handle you. Okay. Tell them bitches to get their mind right. Let me talk to them. Tell them to get their mind right. Okay, Earth signs. Give me a card for Capricorn, um, Virgo, and Taurus Spirit. Y'all gave me too many little be assertive. Y'all already too goddamn assertive. Uh, learning experience. <clears throat> Excuse me, death and wait. Some of y'all had put, I heard ashes to ashes. Some of y'all really had call or close the casket on somebody if you ain't buried somebody for real. Or either um y'all just closing something on the old you is what I'm hearing. Or maybe the improved you. Y'all are looking at the improved you because she done took her mask out, be assertive. Some of y'all are really standing up uh, for y'all stuff. I heard y'all are standing on business this 2024. Okay, ain't no more excuse. Excuses. Maybe people used to come around you making up excuses and y'all used to settle for the excuses that they made. You ain't taking that shit no more. Death, I am learning that endings are merely a beginning. Okay, that shit had to go so I can bring in my new or something to that nature. Take what resonate earth signs and I always leave the rest. Somebody was called to wait, I guess, for you to see something. Maybe I had to do some type of work, change an opportunity earth signs. Y'all had to, to learn how to co-create with y'all most high. Friendship and union, y'all looking at who can you can and cannot run to is what I'm hearing. Who can I run to? Who can I run to? Maybe y'all run to the wrong people or something like that. With y'all present moment, transformation, y'all being transformed, shifted. Earth signs, okay. 
Y'all learn, y'all listen. I know that's real. It takes an idiot to keep doing the same old stupid shit and think that shit gonna change. Cause Earth said you gotta learn one way or the other. And I know y'all be trying shit all the time. Think y'all got this magic button in, and it gonna come out different the next time. No, ma'am. No, sir. It was still the same. Y'all had to learn that with some type of friendship, some type of connection, some type of union. Y'all was looking for somebody to hit a leg up. Maybe y'all was looking for somebody to clap for you, to be proud of you, um, uh, uh, you know, wanting to be around you or something like that, especially during this transformation. I feel like y'all changed for somebody instead of changed for yourself. I made a post um yesterday or the day before yesterday. It said, do the work for you and not them. Okay? Earth signs. Maybe y'all had to learn that shit, baby. What you try to do the work for somebody else? <laughs> All things that glitter. Mm -hmm. Y'all had that mask on too, huh? You see this same mask that, you know, be assertive. Some of y'all were just too gentle to motherfuckers or you just wasn't good for yourself. You kept allowing people to cross the line. Okay? They crossed the line, boss. Yeah, baby. And I feel like these people are doing that shit intentionally. Okay, some of y'all had to stand on, what they say, stand on business. Change, okay. Transform. Be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind, your spirit, and your motherfucking facts. Okay. Because some of y'all had to see something. Something like that earth sign. Take with Riz now. Hello. I hope y'all have an amazing day. What zodiacs do we have? We on earth signs at the moment. And if y'all want to skip the line, just go on catch up. It's a donation, all right? Whatever your donation is, it's going to determine how much information I give you. Okay, spirit. Gratitude. Okay, earth signs. Okay, earth signs. What my cause is? Because y'all know I'm not going to disrespect my tickle me Elmo cause that I designed, y'all. Okay, cause these business, these bitches be on business. You hear me? They be on business. They be scaring the shit out of me. You hear me? Oh my god, my god. Okay, first time. What's up? What's up? What it do? What the business is? Word on the street. Y'all didn't know how to handle y'all Virgo. Um, uh, oh, we doing Virgo spirit. Okay. Y'all be really being paid, Virgo. They called you out. Come on to the front. Okay. Oh, spirit, because you ain't finna do me like that. I'll talk to the earth sign. You gonna just call out Virgo. You'll up call out Virgo. <laughs> spirit. No, you ain't. You ain't finna do that. Not on camera. But yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. King of Wands, natural born leader, entrepreneur, spiritual leader, boss, data protector, handsome. I don't know if y'all kept looking at somebody like that, Virgo, but they said who? They said rude awakening, whatever y'all kept seeing or thought y'all seen in somebody, baby. That was null and void. That wasn't truth. That was false. And y'all had to see that some of y'all were really trying to deal down and like keep from hurting somebody's feelings. I heard y'all mind, Virgo. What is up with y'all mouth? The truth spirit yeah but it's the way that you presenting it that is uh getting on these people nerves heartless unfair unpredicted unstable lack of direction the opposition baby the stumbling block got all in your way virgo because you thought whatever this uh handsome wannabe ass person that you 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 i'm talking about the apple of your eyes something like that virgo y'all would have did anything <laughs> for this person spirit like the hell the hell you will <laughs> Let me get that up out of you. Burn that hill, Virgo. Burn that hill. Submerge, misfortune, stumbling blocks. Yo, the nine of pentacles in reverse. Um, I heard about the flow on um, this morning. Maybe some of y'all was caught to go in some type of flow. Virgo, okay, in flow, creating, intuitive, compassionate, emotionally stable. That's it. They said get your motherfucking emotions in order because your ass ain't thinking right. Ah, is what I heard. Learning experience. Some of y'all had to learn something. And I heard the odd, hard, odd way. Yeah, the odd way. Hard way is what I was about to say. They said y'all could be a little unpaid, did self care, one sided. Charity, look down upon. Y'all dealing with somebody who just tried to look down on y'all virgo and then you try to make them bitches look up you said bitch i ain't dying now but you are dying because the more you kill trying to prove yourself to this person baby hey <laughs> you fail is what i heard take what resonate and i always lead risk what the fuck yeah that person yeah that person a double in reverse disconnect for yourself cutting the cord some y'all are being called the <sighs> to cut some type of cord with somebody that should have taught you a motherfucking lesson. Yo, y'all get some lesson learned. The shit y'all doing to y'all. So, um, unreliability, wobbleness, and mute. 
Yo, something's supposed to be avoided is what I'm hearing. But you kept entertaining it, something like that. Virgo type will resonate. And I always leave the rest of this transformation period. It's like you're postponing this transformation period. And spirit is trying to call you to something better. They like, shoot, shoot, shoot. Get your ass off and I will. And you still trying to stand up there. Maybe you waiting on somebody to do something. Or you just waiting on somebody to clap or say they proud of you. Like, the fuck you waiting on these people for? You don't get your ass off no behind the show you. Day in and day out, how much you are changing or you're meant to do something better than this. And you're going to stand your ass. Okay, Virgo, let me get up out that energy because they ain't finna look at little spirit. I'm finna go spirit because you ain't finna be talking to me in the kind of way. Not on camera. Not on camera. Ace the sword. The truth shall set you free. Okay, Virgo. Y'all better get your ass on up out the way. Negative self talk, optimism, forgiveness. Okay, you done been down that road. You done been hurt before. You done been did all this way and that way. You keep bringing the shit up. So let the fucking shit go, okay? Persevere. Keep going. Don't keep going back. Think you're going to make it forward. Virgo. Take what resonate and I always eat rest with y'all. Y'all ain't finna keep talking to the Virgo like that. I'm finna get up out of the energy spirit because you stepping on my toes and it hurt. Yeah, it does. I know it does. I know, I know, I know. Look, judgment. I'm done. So I'm finna go because y'all scared me. <laughs> y'all scared me. I know it hurt, Virgo. But still, when you act like y'all don't know no better, you creating problems by dealing with problems. Okay, Virgo. Who shit. I'm finna go, Virgo. I don't know about y'all. But let me go. What's your YouTube channel? I am Latoya Coleman. Um, and then I got another one, Twin Flame Tarot 1111. And then I got the Virgo show. Y'all, I got three of them. Three. Mm-hmm. Y'all tried to change my life and did too much at one time. <laughs> Babe, but I'm feeling it, though. I surely am. I'm doing an amazing job. God and gave me. Y'all, I, I woke up this morning, and I looked at, like, how... I had asked for a softer life, and they actually doing it. So, I got time now to build on all them platforms that I created. Like a fool. Okay, I created it. I was like, spirit, I believe in you. Okay, yo, do my YouTube channel. <laughs> okay, Virgo. Let me get back, because my ass be straying off sometimes. Be talking too much. Yo, mm -hmm. yo, disappointment, overindulgence, drinking, greed, poor lifestyle choices. Virgo, when they say, look in the motherfucking mirror before I slump the taste out the back of your throat. <laughs> Y'all got some answers out here that's disappointed too. The answers is mad that you just standing at the moment. What you standing up for? What is you contemplating on and showed you your glory? And then you looking back at your past. Like, if you don't get your... They say, if you don't get your dumb ass off and over here, I'm just gonna say it how they say it. Okay. Okay. Okay, Virgo. Y'all know on the Virgo show, we like this. Okay, alchemist. Okay, on the Virgo show. That how y'all gonna know it's mine. Okay, cause I got that up there. But Virgo, y'all right here. <laughs> ooh, ooh, Virgo. Ooh, Virgo. What's up, Virgo? Little spirit. I heard love. That's the motherfucking problem. Okay, spirit. Which one do you call y'all when you get for love for Virgo? Cause the audacity. So mean today. I swear. I swear, spirit. Yup. Mm -hmm. Okay, Virgo. Hey, they said you wouldn't take it that hard if it didn't resonate. I know, spirit, it resonates. That's, that's, that's the problem. <laughs> What's up for the love for Virgo, spirit? God, I'm scared of these pull cards. Got my damn cheeks shaking. I'm so scared. Spirit, look at this shit. Health, healthy choices. I know, spirit. Healthy choices, Virgo. The chase, I knew that shit was going to come out. Y'all scared me. Cause that was at the bottom. I looked at it and I was like, Spirit don't talk about no chaser shit. Yeah, Virgo. Yeah, chasing codependent relationship, fear of abandonment issues. Okay. Let it go. Whatever this opportunity for you to change, shift, you are already probably walking in the opportunity, but you keep going back. Somebody keep going back. Poor lifestyle choice, codependent. Codependent on what? Trying to get somebody to see you fuck them for. For real, for real. Ooh, spirit. I hear you. Mm -hmm. I surely do. Y'all yeah, take what resonate. And I always leave the rest. I'm scared to get one of my cards, Virgo. I'm going to do water signs. Yeah, I am Latoya calling for my YouTube. Yeah. Dakota. Tap my screen. I do some um, questions. If you want to skip the line, you can donate, though. Earth signs. Yep. I'm on Virgo. 
Ooh, self-indulgence. Focus on self, so word time to heal, shadow work, and self-appreciation, Virgo. <sighs> Damn. Okay, Spirit, what about the money for the Virgo? Because, baby. Hey. I feel like, though, Virgo, y'all hands are closed for some type of receiving spirit. Like, open your goddamn hand. Open your hand to receive or something like that. Maybe y'all do this. Maybe y'all walk around. I don't know. Close off your heart or something dealing with doubt. Some of y'all go in y'all mind and say y'all saw something about your money or time, patience. You ain't got no patience for this. Uh, it's like spirit trying to give you your blessing, but you can't get it because your hand closed. Your eyes closed. Your thoughts gone. You're everywhere. You don't supposed to be. Uh, and then it's like you got to learn how to focus on self. You got to heal yourself, Virgo. Heal from this disaster that you have overcame or you ran into. Because, baby, it is like tearing you down. Virgo, it's women, damn. Yo, king of cults. Oh, spirit. Yo, in order for you to receive this, it's like somebody's looking in the wrong direction. How can you expect this money, this change, this rotation to come into your life when you're looking in the wrong direction, baby? This shit's a focus. Page of Pentacles in reverse. Yo, on what you're calling in because as long as you keep trying to plant your seeds in somebody else's garden, you ain't gonna never reap the, the benefits of you and whatever you got within you. You putting all your good energy, your juju, all your money into somebody else. Uh-uh, baby, that's show shit. You need to learn how to invest in yourself, Virgo, and stop trying to be a team player. You need to play for yourself sometimes, Virgo. Sometimes you deserve it. Sometimes you really deserve it, but you, you just be trying to get it to the wrong people and you be missing out. That's why you ain't be getting depleted so motherfucking much because you're trying to invest in the wrong people. Them people don't really care as much as you think they do. So invest in the people that you know care about you and that shoot. Okay, so your money can come in in a beautiful way. Shit, that shit right there at your door. You can't even get it because you ain't even clean in front of your door yet. What the fuck wrong with you? Spirit's like, I'm trying. It's in, it's in front of the door, babe. Okay, you hear me? You hear me talk to you, right, Virgo? Okay, take a rhythm. And I always leave the rest. Y'all, I forgot my ancestor card. Hold on, let me go get it for the Virgo. Y'all know I got to get the ancestor card. Okay. I appreciate y'all talking to screen. Show my video. Virgo, I had to go up there and get my answers card. Ugh. Okay. So, Virgo. Spirit. Moving on to the Virgos. Take what resonates, you guys. And I always leave the race. What's your zodiac? Put it in the comment section. I'm going to uh, Taurus. Next. What's up with the Virgo? Give me a call for the Virgo Spirit. Yeah, let me catch my break. Okay, dear you. Okay, dear Virgo. There is always more one, more than one side to an argument. Okay, two sides, if not more, to every story and hundreds of ways to be right, be different, be at odds, and so on. What spirit? So when I just talking about odd. Okay, y'all see that? Be at odds. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, today we suggest that instead of looking for differences, you find a meeting, place, a meeting place of an agreement and approach that this experience will with understanding and compassion. Okay. What is it? Yo, whatever this learning lesson was, Virgo, dang. Okay, seek common ground to understand how another person thinks or how an alter alternate plan might be laid. 
stay out of judgment too. Ooh. Okay, spirit, y'all talking. Y'all scamming, man. <laughs> Hold on, Virgo. I gotta finish reading that shit. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. And then let me turn the music down a little bit. Hold on. <clears throat> okay, Virgo. Observe, discern, and accept that others have different stories, experiences, and journeys. And some people might refuse to remain open to others' point of view. No matter what, you've been presented with a great opportunity to explore a new way of doing things. Once coming ground is reached, you're attracting people in situations that enrich your life and bring you wonderful things to learn. Y'all, this shit about to make me cry. Like, fear, what the fuck? This whole energy. Look how this card just wrapped that up beautifully, y'all. Oh my god. Hmm. And it also feels like too Virgo with this judgment and this hierophant out here. Like y'all are critical of yourself. You've been overthinking about some shit. It seems like something pushing you to do some type of healing energy. Maybe your childhood, uh, something from your childhood is coming up. It's like, I don't know, is somebody going to pass away around you? You might be feeling that shit. Or maybe you might be realizing how we're here here to, uh, you know, we're going to pass away. The fuck? But it's certain situations that you put yourself, maybe you looking for longevity and ain't no longevity in them. Self-appreciation. Some of y'all need to appreciate yourself to be who y'all are. That mask that you try to put on to make somebody fit in or make somebody see you or something that you weren't being real about, Virgo. And then you get disappointed by the actions of these people, Virgo. What the fuck? That's their action. That does not show whether you're worthy or not. But some of y'all weigh yourself up against how somebody treats you. But then you keep trying to deal with these motherfuckers. Oh, spirit, I know you being real. <laughs> when you talking about blocking your motherfucking blessing, your happiness, Virgo. Who? You. That's why they say sometimes you can stand in your own way. Get your butt up out the way. Get out the way. I was talking no action. You working with God and you can't see that shit. And you sitting up here trying to get some of Chasey. Like you need this person. You don't. <sighs> okay. Okay, Virgo. Okay. They said forgiveness, passion for life, healing, sacred, sacred experience. God giving you another chance, but then you going to run another direction. Go chase. Let me go. Hold on. Let me go get such a real quick. Cut a bus here. The bus here. Okay. They, they missing the motherfucking bus. And you will too. You keep running back. The fuck wrong with you? Okay. Let me get up out of the energy. Virgo. My bad. My bad. Sorry. My bad, let me clean some Virgo energy up out of me, cause you know that. Ooh, spirit. Y'all, y'all being extra. Okay. Taurus. What's up, Taurus? I hope y'all have an amazing day. What's up with the Taurus spirit? <laughs> let me get another day. Okay. Co-creating. Do the work, Taurus. All earth signs, I guess, are appear, uh, are needing to do the work. But uh, some type of leg up, this changing energy, it's like golden everywhere around you, earth signs. Some of y'all fucking with the fake gold. Some of y'all act like y'all don't know the difference. Okay, y'all had to stand out. Y'all were standing out from the crowd for a reason, earth signs. Okay, that's why all this out here. But okay, Taurus. Taurus, somebody trying to put you in competition with them or something like that they're trying to compete or maybe you're going or keeping you stuck something like that maybe trying to leave somebody or maybe somebody mind keeping you mind stuck on them thought of thoughts about them um something to that nature taking away some type of light taking away your happiness or trying to maybe this person mingles in the crowd so much somebody goes out a lot somebody don't know how to stay home or somebody is just um in a flirty uh always in people's face something like that they will resonate and always lead the rest Somebody might can be a whole Taurus. I don't know. Maybe you decide to walk away from this energy, Taurus. I heard you want to get nowhere. Maybe it was a Leo or a Leo somewhere in your chart. Taurus. Take what resonate and always lead the rest. What they got to be assertive about fear for the Taurus now. I guess speaking your truth too. Shoot. Somebody was uh disappointed, kept disappointed, wasting somebody's time. You're wasting their time, baby. Uh, over and over, Taurus, or something. You felt like this was a waste of time. Whatever the situation you put yourself in. 
Maybe some of y'all waited before y'all took a move or y'all said y'all were gonna wait something out. Um maybe y'all didn't um be impulsive. I don't feel like somebody was impulsive. I feel like somebody tries to do their research before they did something or maybe look at somebody, pay attention to somebody, expect something up out of a person or a situation. And maybe it didn't work out. Like, even all this stuff that you looked into, um, maybe you was talking to other people about this situation. I don't know. Take what resonate. Not always leave the rest. Hello, you guys. You just you just told my friend. You spirit. But, yeah. um, The hermit. It, it feels like, though, this, this, this knowing. Somebody knew something. Um, wisdom somebody had to become a loner or something like that um eliminate something cancel out a situation um mm. Cause I guess you watching this person seeing like somebody was stressing another person out like bro You ain't gonna stress me not with the lies you tell or not the how you walk or maybe this situation Somebody thought it was an opportunity, but it wasn't some type of work that needs to be done or somebody needed to do some type of work or you know I mean, death and the funeral card is out here. You know, some type of um old ending. Uh, endings that bringing in a new beginning on something. Maybe you didn't feel like you wanted this to end. Or somebody just wanted to work on something. Work on a connection. Work on a situation. But I don't feel like it was in somebody's best interest. What's this transformation spirit? That change is right at the bottom, but and, and it's just talking about each other. All this shit is talking about change, opportunity and change, 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 or uh, change for taking all this. Oh, you gotta change. Uh, seeing some shit, you change and learning experience, you change and uh, this waiting energy. Uh, you probably did wait towards. I heard study something or somebody needed to study some y'all. Somebody thought they had all the information that they needed, but they didn't. Um, lovers in reverse, the eight of wands, the two of um, wands in reverse. It was a lot of um, maybe fire energy out here or something like that. Somebody was has fire in their chart. Mm, something dealing with the knowing. Whatever you had knew or you might have known something, Taurus. Um, maybe it was a Gemini you was dealing with. Something killed the person isolated, killed them from seeing. Maybe they need to see the truth. Because it's like almost like somebody was lying to themselves or the information that you got, you probably just didn't know which direction you need to take in. Some of y'all might have went the wrong place, um, had to see something for what it really was. Um, mm, Feel like you should have known better, but you didn't try yourself almost. <sighs> I understand that nothing can grow or evolve without movement. Maybe you was in a dead situation or something like that. Or maybe just uh, whoever you... If somebody had to bury another person, it feels like you you feel like you can't go on. Or or you are in some type of stagnant energy because you're missing somebody. Or some connection, some marriage, some relationship. Some collaboration. Maybe you thought you and this person were supposed to collaborate together. But it didn't work out like that. It needed to be some type of change. What's up with the love spirit? Let me get another card for y'all. Love energy. Hold on. Um, Taurus, take what resonate. And I always leave the rest. Hello, you guys. Y'all put y'all zodiacs in the comment. I appreciate y'all. I appreciate you guys. I hope y'all have an amazing day. On purpose, for real. What's up the love um, for Taurus spirit? Give me that green light. Ooh, true love. Okay. You can let your hair hang down. Okay. This is a, a romance of a lifetime. Maybe this is a situation or maybe I will be attracting in some type of new love or maybe some type of past life um, relationship. Going to come back in trying to, I guess, do something new. Do something new. Um, I don't know if this person going to introduce you them in a new way or something like that. I don't know if y'all going to take this shit to be true. Maybe I was waiting on somebody to get their life right. Or maybe this person from the past, I heard three years or maybe three years ago. Maybe they're going to show you that they are a mature person now. Five, five years ago, worth waiting on. You probably did wait, wait on this person. Divine timing. Maybe it's somebody from your past that you didn't expect going to come into your life. Um, and y'all going to um, start some type of relationship. Um, 
somebody you broke up with from a while ago or maybe somebody you knew when you was a child somebody that you know come into your life make the effort great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take tori okay building a family maybe that's something that you're looking into doing you want to build a family something like that Take what resonate. Now always lead the rest. Give me one song for the money and the tourist, the tourist. Yeah. What's up with the tourist money? Hello, you guys. Aquarius, Scorpio, Libra. Okay. Okay. Okay, what's up? It's um what uh Taurus, some type of will of fortune energy and the magician energy. Y'all finna have to fight for I heard going to the top or something like that. If you want it, you'll get it, you'll achieve it, you'll go for it. Faith without works is dead. So whatever this energy of you shifting your money or uh, how your money you're about to flow in, it depends on you. If y'all feel like y'all going through torment, you're gonna manifest this tormenting energy. Your money gonna be looking funny a lot. Y'all gonna go through a period of having some and then you're gonna fall straight on your face okay but that's because you keep looking at it that way you are the magician the will of fortune it's just your season how they say you creating this whatever you plant is whatever you gonna give out i ain't gonna try to make the season look beautiful because that beauty depends on you take what resonate and i always leave the rest to a piece. all right spirit i'm gonna put some of this on um the virgo show I'm gonna put the Virgos on the Virgos show for baby. Oh, that's a message. Okay, give me a message for the tours. Dang, y'all ain't have to shoot that out like the parts car. Ding dong. Okay, dear wonderful tourists. Intimacy is scary sometimes. It means you have to let someone else get to know the real you, not the perfect, flawless mask you wear for others. No, it's time to reveal the cool you, the passionate you, the imperfect you that is totally you without artifice or walls. Yes, you will be exposed and vulnerable for a time, but it will be so worth it. This is the only way that you will know true closeness with others and you will also be close to spirit and to us. Mm. There is amazing freedom that comes when you let go and just be yourself with another or a group. Release from the invisible bindings that keep you from intimacy is truly empowering. So may we support you wholeheartedly in this choice. You will know yourself better and we hope learn to love yourself as much as we do. Life is about who we are with others. So share it. You will be so glad you did, Taurus. Loving you so, so much. Oh, spirit. I felt that. I feel that, Taurus. Okay, Capricorn. Capricorn. We finna get into it. Ain't no thing but to do with Capricorn. Okay. Let me clean up the damn Taurus energy. Cause I know y'all y'all like y'all shit to be. This is about us. Yeah, it is. Okay. It's about you, Capricorn. Okay. We gonna make it about you. Okay, Capricorn. I ain't gonna do you like that. Let me get this shit off this right, but Give me a second. Hey, you guys. I hope y'all have an amazing day. I'm gonna do Pisces. Um, dang, because I'm only on Earth. I'm not, I'm at the end of Earth. And when I get through with Earth, I'm gonna do air. Because last time I ain't do none one of y'all. I did water and goddamn fire. And it wasn't even fell to the Earth signs and the air signs. Now, I haven't did Pisces on my Virgo. Y'all wanna steal the line? You can donate. And I'll jump all the way wherever you want me to jump to, baby. Depending on your donations is how much information I can give you. But I I hope y'all take what resonate. And I always leave the rest. Capricorn, you know what? It's crazy. This song playing. Everybody ain't your friend. My daughter is a Capricorn, baby. And she's a beautiful one. You hear me? My baby is a go gilder You hear me? She gonna be the first millionaire in this family. I believe in I know how push her to be that. That luxurious energy. Her name is Beyonce, y'all. <laughs> yup. She her, her own. Because I knew Beyonce was gonna be somebody when I was younger. So when I had my baby, yo. But Capricorn, this this her favorite song. So, you know, it's kind of standing out. Everybody ain't your friend. Cause every time, let me tell you, this girl is so powerful. She is a fucking goon in the spiritual streets and on these streets. Like, she make a name for herself. But every time I'm going through shit, my daughter know to play this song. Because it be, it, it's always about somebody that I allowed in my life. And I'm a Virgo. I'm a Virgo. My daughter's that Capricorn. So, Cal, 
this energy right here, you co-creating, you changing, you doing the work. I don't know if y'all get into y'all mind, y'all feelings or something like that. Maybe you have some birds might be in your ear. Maybe you got wings of an angel, but not of birds or something like that. Maybe you might be bigger or you're, you're aiming to be a bigger person. The first, you know how they say, breaking the generation of curse, you stopping the things in your life and you just setting the trend, you setting the tone. Somebody is setting a tone on um, Capricorn. Y'all might use that term too loosely because that's what I was hearing the other day. It, it ain't uh, y'all like him trying to get people to support y'all. Y'all trying to get the wrong friends. Okay, y'all trying to get people that y'all think are y'all friends to support y'all. No, that's why they can't support you because they want your friend in the, get, in the, in the beginning. It's what I'm hearing, Capricorn. Everybody ain't your friend, however they go. Okay. Okay, Capricorn. Look, the hermit, introspection, solitude, reflection, inner guidance, rest, or whatever. Searching for some meditation retreat. Some of y'all are being called to go on some type of retreat or look at things differently because y'all reevaluate some things. Somebody will try to weigh you down or something, keep you from your bliss and your balance, your purpose. Some of y'all are being called to have some type of harmony in your life, Capricorn. Um, balance out some things. Something that's weighing you down is wrong. Also wrong is what I'm hearing. If you're trusting the most high, then I feel like whatever this 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 energy that's being shaken up off you, um, you got to learn how to let that go with the wind, go with the flow or something like that, Capricorn. Capricorn. Summer rise and take what resonates. And I always leave the rest. Spirit, I'm thirsty. Two of swords and three of wands. Yeah, balance, force, truce, and stalemate. Like, you know how sometimes you, you have to keep the peace within your house or keep the peace within yourself? Because I feel like y'all looking at something in the future. Y'all trying to see this partnership. This is attract helpful people. Yeah, yeah, it's looking at the bigger picture. You're seeing that uh, successful business partnership. I said that y'all building for that. Maybe some of y'all are just investing in y'all. So cleaning up something, uh, learning something new, investing in something, looking at something, you know, things that look like it can be achievable you can achieve this shit you working they said with god i could do anything and you can y'all looking at y'all higher yourself and you just looking at yourself and saying i'm worth it i am worth it you are a capricorn you are a vibe capricorn thanks capricorn the hermit want to keep going out chariot yeah some of y'all had to overcome some type of adversity some of y'all will be starting some type of travel business or some of y'all gonna be traveling people gonna ask you to come to their places in order for them i don't know they're gonna pay you y'all know how they go influencer some of y'all might be an influencer or something like that i don't know y'all might be um y'all gonna have people calling y'all some of y'all are about to call in some type of life that you didn't even think that you was going to have is what I'm hearing. Some of y'all going to look like a professional or y'all will be a professional, knowledgeable Capricorn. Take what resonate. And I always lead the rest. Y'all come calling this energy in. New beginning. Um, take a leap of faith. Some of y'all had to. Invest in yourself. Change yourself. Do something real with yourself. Work the most high. I can do anything. When God tell you to leap, you leap. Okay? You got wings, but not of a bird. You hear me? You got wings of an angel. And that's why you're able to soar through things. Once you start to choose yourself, Capricorn, the rest is history. Okay? Or uh, her story. Yeah, it's, it's that Take a raise name and I always leave the rest. God is, I love that name. Laverta dude. I know that's real serious. Some of y'all are looking at who y'all can and cannot trust, rely on. Y'all ain't gonna have everybody in y'all face. This elevation, you know how people want to sit around you because you got something that they want. You gonna learn to stick to your intuition. I heard you being that loner, the popular loner. People gonna have a little issue with you being that popular, but by yourself. You don't need nobody to make you is what I'm hearing, Capricorn. So it's gonna be like a lot of shifts and changes in your life and it's a blessing. Okay, it's a blessing. As long as you take it to be true, Capricorn, what's up with your love? 
What is up with your love, Capricorn? This high honor. That's I feel like that's what y'all take uh attracting. Uh healing family issues. I said them curse breakers. If y'all breaking curses on over y'all life or what y'all used to do, y'all family used to do what you was taught when you was little. It's like things is changing for the better. Like you holding yourself in high honor, you see the value within yourself. You're gonna attract a valuable people into your life. And I feel like some of y'all looking for somebody who got it like that. You know what I'm saying? Chemistry. Yeah, and wait and see y'all think it's smart or not hard of course you if they ain't worth your time you ain't finna be dealing with no bitches you hear me y'all looking for marriage like my you know i ain't gonna tell her business because i know my daughter is an amazing woman <laughs> you hear me yeah breaking the curses indeed stepping on these liberty bitches next indeed because they slept on her and i know she was gonna push her through a lot so kept going when people sleep on you Okay, you be ready to go. That's why they call you to go for a reason. But, yo. Okay, so what's up, Z Money? For Z Capricorn Spirit. Capricorn Money. What's up, the money? What's up, the money? I mean, that's a lot. Shit. I heard if it's up, it's still. Some of y'all are just being, uh, you know how they say, uh, free spirited, inspirational. Y'all probably might be inspiring other people. Something dealing with deliver uh liberation or something like that. Some of y'all being delivered, transforming, loosening the chains off you. Spirit is guiding you up out of something, getting you the keys. Your keys, okay. Some of y'all might be moving to a house or something like that. Some of y'all are in this this six of uh one's energy winning or something like that. Uh win something, windfall, Capricorn. Um, I don't know if y'all got like whatever this entrepreneurial spirit. Um, I heard the cash cow, something dealing with cash cow coming in too. All right, so let me get um. This. All right, spirit for the Capricorns, give me an answer for Okay, okay, Capricorns. I hope y'all have an amazing day. You too. I appreciate everybody. So cool. I hope y'all have an amazing day. Give me a call for the Capricorn Spirit. Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn Spirit. I don't need one on be extra. I don't need that many messages. I feel like some of y'all Capricorn got a lot of ancestors around you, a lot of protection, a lot of spiritual guidance. Something is in your defense or something like that. Y'all got some fight for y'all. Maybe when people come up against y'all, try to try y'all. Y'all got some unseen energies behind you protecting you. I heard, uh, dearest Capricorn, isn't it amazing how things seem to come around again full circles in ways you could not possibly have planned? You wonder how a dream could die, only to be real res uh, res uh, resurrected years later when you're really ready. You thought it was time back then, but the wisdom knows better that your small self, whose desires are unmet. Now, here you are with a new opportunity to do things from a different, more mature perspective. We want you to trust that in the new opportunity for rebirth, that's that death card, y'all, okay? You will be called in two directions, and the one that is unfamiliar will be the right one. So, whatever this journey y'all going on, this knowledge that y'all taking, the two of swords, some of y'all got about to make a decision. Y'all finna see that the journey y'all, whatever the one that is not familiar to you, take that one. It's what I'm hearing. In the unknown spaces, the uncharted places of infinite potential, we are waiting to guide you into your fullest life. Be ba big bounty will come in. You remain in the present. You have come full circle. It says big bounty will come if you remain in the present. You have come full circle. And now you can see that everything changes, is made new, and is giving new hope. Loving you always, Capricorn. Live your dreams, and that's fast. Okay, from heaven. I know that's real. They say heaven on earth, Capricorn. Shoot, that's a blessing. Fast, straight like that. I'm finna go to um air sign Libra, Aquarius. What's the other um air sign? Is it Gemini? Gemini, Aquarius, Gemini, and um, Libra. I think I got that right, y'all. Y'all let me know the air signs. I think I'm, I think I'm saying right. 
I need some water. Let me get me something to drink real quick. I'm finna do Z Air Signs, Gertrude Spear. Take what resonates, you guys, and I always leave the rest. If you want to skip the land, um, there goes my cash up. I only did the Earth Sign, Virgo, Taurus, and um, Capricorn. In that order, too. And y'all, I got you too, too. I am the toy. You call me? The Virgo Show and Twin Flame Tarot 1111. So I love twinsies out there. Okay, Eric Sign, what we gonna do? Let me, let me show you. Okay, Empathy. Surrender. Helpful people. Okay, Eric Sign, we gonna rock with this. Improving health. Perseverance, Eric Signs. Okay. Y'all got an observer out here, air signs. Okay. Y'all are calling in some type of helpful people. Maybe some of y'all are overcoming some type of sickness or something. Or maybe somebody in your family was kind of sick. Maybe some of y'all was called to rest. Somebody had to have some type of resting phase. Somebody had to take like a week-long break or some type of break. Or they're uh, planning some week-long vacation or something like this. Um, new life is what y'all pulling in. I don't know if some of y'all had like this near, near death experience or something like that, but it, it had you to see something different, air sign. Something dealing with grief and intuition and download. Some of y'all was stuck somewhere. Y'all felt like y'all was stuck somewhere here and now. Relationship stuck in a relationship with somebody felt like it. You you y'all wasn't getting anywhere. I am attracted to those people who serve my highest good. Not the right time and round and round. Some of y'all kept going through the same old thing with somebody. Um, some of y'all pushed through it. Some of y'all had some advice, therapists, uh, seek advice or something like that. Some of y'all had to go to the doctor, get some type of uh, diagnosis is what I'm hearing. Every sign take will resonate. And I always leave the rest y'all. Come at your um, Zodiac. I appreciate you. It's just going to put me on the FYP. I mean, FYL page. I appreciate you guys. Okay, Spirit. So, what's up with the air sign? Oh, yeah, my man. Okay, Trick. <laughs> what's up with the air sign? Aquarius. Aquarius, intuition, and download. Some of y'all are on y'all highest vibration. Can you see how this information is coming from within her? Like she's trusting herself or being made to trust herself. Something dealing with a wooden spoon. Or some of y'all got Indian in y'all blood too. Um, directions. This information is coming from within you. Like all these different areas. Your intuition is just on point or something like that. Maybe you might be scaring somebody. Something told you something about another person. And maybe you're seeing that you're just a spiritual being. Y'all seeing some things that other people don't see or something like that, Aquarius. I feel like y'all just open up, tap in something. Something to do with smile. Somebody is called to smile. Oh, somebody is called to look at things differently. Uh, sound decision making, opportunities, breakthrough, success or something like that. Maybe y'all overcame something that y'all felt like, I don't know. It's, I feel like somebody had a vision. Uh, either some type of premonition came through about somebody and y'all listened. Um, it's almost like, I remember somebody told me a story. Like, they seen something before it happened. And, well, a few, few of y'all told me that type of story. Um, y'all seen some shit before it happened. Some of y'all were scared to say something to a person. Y'all could have saved somebody's life or something like that. Maybe somebody felt like they could. Um, some of y'all seen something before it happened. It kind of scared y'all, but it came to, you know, pass. Maybe y'all were too scared to say something. But I feel like y'all are in the energy of Aquarius. Y'all can see. Y'all can see or hear or spirit is just talking to y'all. Y'all probably didn't know, but it was just, um, I, I know, right? I like this song, too. You messed up some of your taxes. You probably did because you probably didn't know what you were doing. That unpredictable flaw. You might got a flaw, too, on your taxes. Fresh Xavier. You sent the cash up. Let me see. I got my own cash up thing open. Okay. I appreciate you. But I answer your question though, Xavier. Dang, that's crazy. I had answered. Didn't even know you had sent it. But yo, that's your answer.
But yeah, you might need to go back over. I appreciate you guys. Okay, Aquarius. Okay, Aquarius. Unpaid debt self care. Some of y'all freed yourself for something. Somebody was trying to look down on you, or maybe you probably under underestimated some type of information that you got. Uh, unpaid debt self care. Somebody was called to have some type of self care. I don't know if y'all going through some type of diagnosis, going to the doctor visit. Somebody had a doctor visit, and maybe you didn't see it for what it really was. Maybe you kept it to yourself, or maybe you, your intuition told you something, and maybe you didn't trust that. Uh, I am open to seeing both sides of a situation. Some of y'all just tapped into the spiritual realm and it kind of is creepy, creepy y'all out or something like that. Maybe it was about a friend. Maybe y'all heard something that happened in y'all community. Uh, something that was going to happen and it happened. Food, awakening. Some of y'all is awakening into something. Changes, elevating, new beginning, um, free spirited, adventurous, you know. Y'all just stepping into that, guided by the most high, something like that. Um, authority, established, protector energy. Maybe y'all are in this energy. Aquarius. I appreciate it. Some, somebody lost something or feel like they losing something, some type of relationship, some type of connection was telling you that something was going to go away. Y'all lost it. Challenges. Yo, somebody was told that some type of challenge was going to come up about um, defense, uh, protection. Maybe y'all was meant to protect yourself from something or somebody. However, this situation went. Take what resonate and I and I always lead the rest. Three of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, and the Lovers, Disharmony, Misalignment, Self Love. Maybe y'all started to love on y'all self. Y'all need, y'all was called to love on y'all self. Some type of uh, self-care. Maybe y'all was called to raise. Somebody was called to raise because somebody's body was turning against them. Putting yourself through a lot of stuff. Y'all had to push through the pain or something like that. Um, I don't know if you can lie to yourself or somebody had a lot of burdens on them or you was taking on a lot, dealing with a lot, and it's like your body just did what it did. Or whoever this person is around you. Take what resonates. And I always lead the rest. What's up with the love spirit? What card is on? Okay. What's up with the love with the Aquarius? The Aquarius spirit. What's up with the love? Learning and growth. Recognition. Some of y'all are recognizing something too. I feel like when y'all get into a connection though, Aquarius, y'all love working with people. Y'all talk the screen and show my video. I appreciate you. I ain't did Leo yet. I appreciate you. I appreciate you guys. And y'all want to donate? I got some gifts up there. Y'all, I need five of them. I need five of them. I truly appreciate y'all. I truly appreciate y'all. Give me love. Love for Aquarius spirit. Dang, y'all trying to burn up something? <laughs> The sword and rose and the mask. Truth, clarity, revelation, solidarity, power, protection. I don't know what is, all this protection, Aquarius. Y'all was called to have some type of uh, protection. Somebody you felt like was pretending, gaslighting you or something like that. Separation. Y'all might be in separation from somebody. Um, maybe the truth came out while y'all was in separation. Not today. Somebody didn't want to deal with something. Not dealing with hurt. Avoiding the conversation. And I feel like you not dealing with something has caused... Some type of uh, tower moment in your body. Or uh, somebody, you know, uh, I I can't release my need to control whoever this is that's trying to control something. Or try to control somebody. It's like you didn't get nowhere. This person didn't get nowhere. Somebody is angry, upset with you. Or you might be upset with somebody. Engagement. Somebody might have called a partnership, a union, or marriage, or something off. They called it off. Maybe you're upset. Maybe you didn't see this. Maybe I was planning a wedding with somebody. Um, this person they renee. Maybe y'all spade players. <laughs> it's about a renee. It's somebody's reneging on this connection, or they took away, or they didn't put in, or they didn't, you know, intentionally walk away. Something like that, Aquarius. What's up with y'all money? Let's just say return of the Meg. Okay. 
Baby, I ain't heard this song. I like this song though when it come on. Um, uh, something that want y'all the sun happiness uh coming in for y'all uh, Aquarius. I heard it was moving slow, but this happiness energy, your money satisfied, abundance energy, reaping what you sow energy is coming in for you. I don't know if y'all was codependent on somebody or y'all thought y'all wanted to build or take somebody along with you, but it's not going to work like that. Not with this person, whoever this situation y'all was in. Maybe y'all scared somebody going to take y'all money too. Y'all might be in a divorce with somebody and something dealing with your money. Um, your growth, your elevation, maybe some of y'all do have wealth. And maybe you was with this person when you was building. I feel like somebody going to try to take something. Um something like that um i don't know maybe y'all are um, something <laughs> that's crazy baby. ten of wands in reverse um something dealing with liability i don't know if y'all got assets with somebody or something to that nature but i heard the split or something like that somebody gonna try to take your money somebody gonna try to take your money take something on uh, knight of swords in reverse it's a lot of immature energy up out here damn night it's night somebody's very immature somebody is determined to take something from you aquarius or money or slow your money down they praying for your money to stop stop somebody might be lying on your name you might was in a business with this person or something like that but Mm, whatever this person is doing is affecting or gonna try to affect your money or block your your newness or something like that um maybe y'all dealing with a karmic ass person or maybe this person's just so sick you know toxic maybe y'all running a business and it's like somebody gonna do a review on you and say some negative things take what resonate and i always leave the rest i don't think that's gonna affect you though aquarius but they're gonna try it I almost waste your time though. Something dealing with uh fragrance, um flowers, somebody with like flower, and I ain't gonna say it's perfume, but it's like a body mist. Somebody smell like flowers. You know, car for the Aquarius spirit. Take will resonate and I always leave the rest. I know that's real divine they protect the baby. I can tell. Take what resonate, you guys. Let me see. Dear Aquarius, sometimes you just feel like no one understands you. You're not heard or even that you don't count. This, my dear, is a terrible illusion. And although your feelings tell you that abandonment is real, well, we who love you know better. You are never alone. And even when rejection happens, you are ultimately being protected. So better things can replace what that didn't work in the first place. Everyone on this side of the veil is watching you and rooting for your ultimate success. Life loves you. We love you. And you are a unique spark of the divine and always connected to the lights and to the source. You are always in our care. Trust and keep the faith. Love you always and forever. Prayer is. Dang, that was math and spirit. Indeed. Indeed. Libra. And it's Libra. Libra, Libra, let me clean this Aquarius energy out real quick. Hold on, give me a second. Let me clean out this Aquarius energy. I appreciate y'all. How are y'all? Casey, I need to know about my daughter. Oh, you want to cash out? You cash out the skip line, baby. My cash up is somewhere. It's peeing somewhere, but yo. I shall will read you. But when you donate. <laughs> Take what resonate. And I always leave the rest. I appreciate the shares. Oh my God. Y'all are so amazing. Oh, uh, who I said? Libra. We finna do Libra. Hold on, Libra. Because I know I like to have the clean, cleanse the energy out real quick. Because I don't want to mix me. Ooh. All right, Spirit, what's up with the Libra? What's up with the Libra? Spirit, gratitude. What is this? My heart. Okay. What's up with this new life, Libra? This new life that you calling in, Libra? Take what resonate. And I always leave the rest. If y'all want to steal the line, you can. I did Virgo. I did Earth signs. All Earth signs. I did Aquarius. 
and now i'm on libra you guys and then after the air sign i'll be doing um water and then fire water and then fire so what's a libra mind valley I don't know, maybe y'all, some of y'all mind. I heard um, maybe y'all are resting in y'all mind. Something dealing with daydreaming too, um, Libra. Or maybe y'all trying to daydream or y'all dream. Something dealing with your dreams. Um, maybe y'all getting some type of information like that. Um, something dealing with your mind. Some of y'all seeing some things. Maybe y'all around people that y'all keep seeing stuff and y'all speaking on it. And these people trying to say that you ain't seeing what you seeing, Libra. But y'all know what y'all seeing or something like that. Uh, so I heard something dealing with ghosts too, Libra. I don't know if y'all seeing spirits. Or maybe y'all ghosting somebody or something like that, Libra. Something like that. I heard there's something on the other side. Maybe y'all looking at some situation to Libra. Maybe have somebody y'all trying to understand somebody or something like that, Libra. Did that. Take what resonate. And I always lead the rest. Hmm. Tension, competition, empty victory. Y'all got somebody with the five of one side. I mean, five of swords, you guys. Damn. Yeah, I see that. Then I say something with the mind. Bad memories, feeling out of place, dwelling too long on past stuck root, memory loss. I feel like y'all feel like y'all in the wrong uh spot. Uh maybe y'all look at something thought this was gonna be a good situation, but it wasn't it's something dealing with the X, the letter X or something like that. Maybe somebody's name start with the X, or maybe it's an X person that you used to deal with. Somebody put an X or something. Maybe something that was supposed to be done with. Mm -hmm. Y'all didn't do that. That's y'all sign in the reverse, Libra. Justice in the reverse, unfair, dishonesty, bias tape, no accountability, fickle, caught in the red tape. Somebody y'all somebody caught somebody do something or something to that nature. Your mind led you somewhere. Maybe some type of information fell into your lap, Libra. Maybe you seen like you knew that you weren't supposed to be in this situation, whatever somebody's putting you in. I feel like you let somebody put you in a situation or either you just allowing some things, Libra. Y'all just was allowing some things that it was too much is what I'm hearing. Take what resonate. Look, lack of a uh, uh, team work, uh, mediocre, poor performance. Y'all kept allowing this shit. Nine of swords, all in your mind, suffering, worry, anxiety, sleepless night, overreacting, overwhelmed, guilt, uh, delay, time here, all wounds. Y'all might thought time was going to be able to heal this shit, but some of y'all just stuck in, stuck in something or stuck in a loop, stuck in some mud, somebody's shoes, something got stuck in some mud or something. Y'all messed up some shoes. I don't know. Take a resonate and I always leave the rest, leave rub. Y'all call it just popping up like toaster strudels coming up out the goddamn toaster oven. Yeah, mm, something probably popped up in the, uh, in your life like that. Somebody popped back or somebody left and came back. Something like that. Some of y'all was buckling up on the pressure. Some of y'all try to avoid something. Somebody keep lying. Somebody keep blaming another person. I feel like you need some type of time to yourself or something like that. Um, your intuition showed you something. Maybe y'all seen this shit in a sleep dream state. I don't know. Take what resonate. Not always either is. She is a Libra. Oh my god. Avoiding responsibility. Somebody's worth ten of swords. What's a nine of swords and ten of swords? Now that's the worst of the worst. Misfortune, pain, the lowest point, defeat, crisis, backstab, surrender. Surrender's out here two times. I release my need to control. I don't know if you were trying to control somebody or somebody was trying to control you. Uh, you still at, at back at square one with somebody. Somebody keep doing the same old shit, just different day. Um, maybe you be trying to overlook what's going on with this person, but it's hard to avoid. Somebody's, uh, you know, aimlessly wandering, abounding your dreams, sacrificing your happiness, hanging too long on somebody, some connection. You know, you don't even want to be dealing with no more. Somebody just every day. It's always some every fucking day. It's always some. It's like they were doing um, Libra and y'all know that. 
same shit, though. It's the same shit. It's just a different day. Every day, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Karmic block. Turn sour materialism is run its course, smothering greedy, overwrite. Um, something dealing with neglect. Um, somebody poor lifestyle choices, they dissatisfied. Somebody just do too much, they do too much, and then it's like you take too much. <laughs> you take too much. Look at this shit. Somebody take too much when it comes. Look at all these cards. Y'all ain't finna keep knocking me damn cards off. Y'all know that's where look at the hyphen out there two times. One in reverse and one in the up right, y'all. These cards going to fall how they want to. I got, y'all see all these? See these cards? They just falling, y'all. I'm on my little table. Yo, I ain't telling no bitch to fall. But yo, I'm just going to take them, okay? But yo, the hyphen is out here in reverse. In and up, right? This commitment. Maybe somebody can't commit and you can. Y'all supposed to be together. Y'all might be two peas in the pod. Y'all might be in a twink connection y'all might just be married or in some type of deep soul tie with this person the relationship you know the connection y'all know y'all supposed to be standing out together y'all might stand out together with this person all the time forgive them a lot whatever they do you keep allowing them back into this and this person make up excuses on why they do what they doing i don't know if somebody money going crazy or something like that somebody lying about what they do with their money or they don't make enough um maybe struggle somebody watch you struggle or something to that nature take what resonates how to spend too much time on y'all Libras. Who spirit? Alright, so what's over the love with the Libra? Because this too much for me. Baby. If y'all want to skip the lane, my cash up up there. Um, I done did the whole earth signs, Aquarius. And I'm almost done with the Libra. Give me a call for the Libra. I don't know why I had to get the Hidden Truth Oracle, but I felt the need to. Okay. I appreciate you. I appreciate you guys. What's up, the Libra? Give me one call, Spirit. Cheater affair. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I wish things could be different. See, that's why I feel like y'all holding on to Libra. Y'all kept holding on to the person because y'all thought things going to change. Maybe the person kept saying they're going to change, but they don't change. They don't change. Some of y'all know that shit. Y'all feel like when somebody tell y'all something, y'all try to look at the good in these people. But nah, that person, you know how these people do. That's why I said they can't commit. They always cheating and doing some out the way. Me, bruh. Um, let me get something with their money, Spirit. What cards do you use for their money? The Libra. I thought I brought my other cards down here. Oh, okay. Give me something for the Libra. Libra, I don't know if somebody told you that you need to invest in them or something like that, but they say you better not be spending your money on somebody. Don't be take care of nobody. I don't know if you sit up here believing that somebody uh, is worthy enough for you to take care of if they ain't your motherfucking children or your, your mama or something like that. You don't, you don't get the hell out of this shit. Somebody using you or something like that. <laughs> they going to try to. Or they, they are or something like that. The king of swords with the nine of... Wow. Wow. I feel like some of y'all know y'all investing y'all money in the wrong area. Or maybe you feel like you're not going to be able to get some money back. Or somebody is in some type of crunch with money. Somebody is not helping with money. I don't know this connection. I feel like you just get giving too much with this something. Something shit. Pouring into something. Somebody ain't pouring into you. Uh, nine of coins. Then reverse some type of monetary block. Restraint. Fear. Somebody ain't helping me pulling their part, doing their part. Ten of swords in reverse. Spirit, y'all got nine of swords out here twice. And the ten of swords out here twice for the Libra. Okay, I'm finna get up out y'all energy. Six of wands in reverse. Mm-mm. Y'all better stop getting any folks y'all money. Y'all know y'all money is looking a little funny. That ain't low. That stupidity is what I heard. But say what resonates. And I always leave the rest. Especially you work hard for this shit. You want to get away. That's stupidity, okay? That the shenanigans, the strength in reverse. I know spirit. I know spirit. So what's what? Let me give a spiritual cohort for the Libra. But if y'all into us come down and talk to y'all Libra, y'all gonna get. They gonna give you an ear fool. You know what I mean? And I feel like your heart is still been telling you some shit. You just ain't been paying attention. Yeah, I feel like y'all been getting clues from the universe, Libra. Clues from the universe, and it's like you gonna see it or you ain't gonna see it. And Libra, y'all ask me looking up, looking in like I don't see, I don't see it. Be right down your face. Some y'all see something, 
and y'all home, but keep telling y'all stuff that you don't. You do. You do. Okay, spirit. Take what resonates. And I always leave the rest. Dearest Libra, you have a secret to share with you. We have a secret to share with you. What? What? Can y'all read this? Let me read like this. We have a secret. Okay, let me stop. If you act as if all is well, it will be. Act as if you have you are brave and you will have enough courage. Act as if you are love and you will be a magnet for love and experience the love of spirit. Act as if your prayers have been answered, as if you are truly in sync with good fortune. How you think is how you will see the world. Interact with it and draw conclusions from it. If you want to be the person who has the life you want, co-creating and loving what is yours, you need to start acting as if you that was true. Don't worry about the conditions in your life that seem empty or cannabis. Is that what I say? Cavernous? Okay. Chaotic or barren. These are temporary and don't even count. Defy them and act as if you're the luckiest person on the planet. You will be and you um and for you I already are. The real secret, you are infinite potential. Loving you so much rainbows explode in the egg. I don't know. It says loving you so much, rainbows explode in the ethers. So it's like, uh, didn't I say some signs? Because they said rainbows exploding in the ethers. Y'all might be seeing some um, rainbows too, Libra. Okay. Whew. I don't know. Something dealing with the damn, some type of signals. Bat signals or something like that. You know how something be happening during the time it happen, you feel it. Like yo, your intuition should be telling you something. Like maybe y'all be having sex with somebody that's cheating on y'all or something like that. Y'all can feel it. Y'all can feel when somebody not being real with y'all. Y'all can feel when somebody got another person on them. You feel it. Damn it. You can smell it too. I be telling people I be smelling. That's why that's why baby when I get with somebody and I can smell like I can smell another woman on them. And then I can taste another woman on them. Like, I can tell when they been out doing some shit. Baby, I go, when I get the sniffing on your neck, you already know what I'm sniffing for, baby. They don't know. They didn't know. I just told my secret. But, baby, when I get the smell on your neck, I'm smelling that other person. I'm trying to see because I can smell stuff. I can smell out of this world type stuff. And I can smell when somebody's energy is on. I know a lot of y'all can, too, because I know y'all talk about it, too. So, I smell it. And then when I lick they neck, baby, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to see if I can taste the bitch. And if I taste the hoe, I know it's a problem. It's a problem. And then they be like, what, baby, what? They know I don't be lying. Whew. Look, I regret lying to you. Mm, mm, that's how they be feeling, y'all. Let me get up out of the energy. Because, baby, that's exactly when uh, Libra, y'all be smelling it, tasting it. And then let me tell you, when, when I get ready to give him some, some, some good throat busters, okay? And if I taste the bitch down there, oh, it's issues. It's issues. It's issues. Let me get out of that energy because I, I can taste it. I can taste it. English. Gemini. Ooh, let me, let me clear the energy, Gemini. Hold on. I don't know. Because I know I ain't you. I know. I, I know. When, when, when you when you worry about your man and your woman cheating on you, baby, baby, okay. When I say my nostrils will spread open, I be smelling the soul, the spirit on that person, baby. Who? I'm going deeper than the flesh, baby. I'm I'm trying to see. I know, I know, I ain't gotta smell your drops. I ain't even gotta smell your dick to be honest with you. But I smell that neck. And then I and then taste it for clarity, bitch. Mmm, let me see. Let me taste. Let me taste it. Oh, you dealing with that kind. I can tell what type of woman it is. I bet y'all can pull her down to the T and tell you exactly what she look like. <laughs> hey. Hey, just by the taste and the smell, baby. Mm-mm. 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 Lord, I'm ready to get up out of that energy. Okay, Gemini. Oh, we're gonna keep that right though. Let me give me some drink. How y'all feeling? How y'all feeling? Y'all put y'all zodiacs in the comments. Say, I appreciate you. Hello, you guys. I hope y'all have an amazing morning. If y'all want to skip the line, I will. I'm on Gemini. Y'all got some time. I got my little beet juice to give me some energy. I hope it give me a little, y'all. Because, Lord, have mercy. Okay. So, Gemini spirit. Hey, guess what, Gemini? We're going to do something different. 
for y'all is. We're gonna start out with love real quick. For the Gemini. Gemini. Gemini spirit. Give me a call for the Gemini. I love yourself first. I know that's real. Um, your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Okay, Gemini. Look high on her. Damn. Your message. I know that's real. Something dealing with your children too. Gemini number seven and twenty-five. Two and five and seven. Maybe seven, seven might have some type of significance. Maybe y'all are seeing the number seven. The number seven means protection. If you didn't know, now you know something is being protected. Or maybe you're um seeing your higher self um protecting your kids. Maybe you got kids, or maybe you want to build a family or something like that, Gemini. Oh, honeymoon maybe you're um some type of honeymoon with somebody or you want to go on holiday time with somebody if you building with this family have a family want to take your kids on some type of um vacation or something some y'all are having some type of conversation about something discussing your feelings um maybe you got if you have a family maybe somebody want to come in and talk to you about taking your kids somewhere um hmm. okay spirit yeah, take what resonate and I always eat the rest. Or maybe you're just discussing on where you want to take your kids, you know. Okay. What is this for you? I'm trying to listen. All right. What's up with the Gemini spirit? What's the message? What's the message? Somebody's going to be sending a message soon, or maybe y'all just going to be seeing something. Damn. Ooh, spirit uh struggling family or something like that whatever this message is maybe this y'all been worrying about him hmm this person want to take somebody somewhere but i feel like you y'all might try to discern the situation maybe y'all trying to see can y'all trust this maybe y'all have been praying about something asking for some, some type of clarity on uh where somebody gonna go um you know how sometimes you can deal with immature people and then they just all of a sudden all of a sudden pretend like they grew up or something or they're gonna do right maybe y'all don't trust to see if this or know if this person gonna do right maybe y'all used to live together y'all broke up y'all was married y'all separated y'all got kids in the middle somebody trying to co-parent or something like that maybe you got into an altercation with this person y'all had a lot of tensions arguments you had to learn how to release them cutting the cords from them gemini but now they trying to come back for some kids baby some maybe y'all might be pregnant maybe the person want to take your baby somewhere or something like that and you don't know. I don't feel like you should trust that shit neither because I don't know where this shit going to go. <laughs> somebody probably want to put somebody on a boat or like a cruise or something like that. Take a child, child, please. Ooh, spirit. I'm coming from a mama's spot. Cause baby, what? And this person immature too. Problems. It might be a chance. You might not see your kid no more. I don't know. Say what resonates. And always leave the risk. I understand that losing some somebody probably took their kids or somebody feel like their kids they can't see their kids. Somebody's getting them trouble on dealing with some type of relationship. You might have been married to somebody, co sold contract, or was supposed to co-parent with somebody, and the, the other person is not doing their part, securing a bad working parent or something like that, little sacrificing their dreams, um, trying again. Somebody don't have time for themselves. Maybe this person gonna come in and tell you they want to take the child up out of you or something. But it's like uh, you don't know you can trust them. I don't know neither. But I don't feel like you can. Needle took me at my call said too. I don't know. Take what business name. Now a little challenge, competition, protection. Oh my god. Fighting out this person. Maybe this person is putting up a fight with you towards your kids, towards y'all kids. Maybe somebody's trying to say them are not their kids or something like that. Or something done with children. Take what business name. Now always lead the motherfucking risk. Right. And activeness, self-discipline. Complaint. Somebody being stubborn, um, hiding something. Somebody's trying to make another person feel a certain type of way about their parenting skills, something like that. You know, maybe this person's trying to control little traveling. For some of y'all, they might travel now. I'm trying to think, trying to think. Okay, okay. It might be coming up in the summertime, something like that, Gemini. Or maybe somebody will, you know, they have to go off and they want to take some kids. But shit, you trying to see if I don't get my kid back. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> Hell no. Hell to the now, you know. I don't blame y'all. say that too. <laughs> I say that too. And my intuition kept telling me. Because these six the ones and the eight of ones, they ain't nothing but the seven of ones again. If, if, if your intuition keeps telling you, do not. 
I don't know. You know how sometimes a person can, you can be in a partnership with somebody and then y'all separate. Okay, you cool while they separate, but then they get with somebody. Okay, your intuition can tell you. It's no hate involved. Okay, it's nothing but your pure intuition telling you that these people, you know, sometimes they be with somebody that they don't even like them people kids. They be hurting them folk kids and all that. And don't just being real. They might be dealing with somebody that don't like your kids or something like you know how people get, but they so gullible and they get to think, well, I thought she loved kids or he loved kids. He just do so much for the kids. And then if the kids tell the story, the kids gonna say, Well, they they be doing this and that to me. They be doing this and that. You 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 know it. You know it because your intuition had already told you. Okay. Okay. Gemini, y'all got some kids and some involved. I don't know. Y'all better protect y'all babies. That's how I'm going to say. You better protect them little babies. You hear me? Your family, your children, whoever this is that's coming up, trying to come up against you or about your kids or something like that, please protect them, okay? And look at the babies out there. Okay. Divine intervention. Mm-hmm. And wherever this water, because they look like they on boats. I don't know if somebody going on a cruise. Tell you what resonate. And I always leave the rest. If they are going on a cool, baby, no. Nah. <laughs> Maybe next year we going to, uh -uh, I don't know, just something in that ain't right. You're going to come back with a, a tragic story. And you ain't going to like that shit. I ain't got time to jeopardize it. <laughs> um, what's up with the love? Oh, I already did it. I, okay, the money. What's up with the money with the Gemini spirit? Yup. Tap, tap, tap in. Tap, tap, tap in. What's up with the Gemini money? Baby. Okay. I heard something doing with y'all investment. Something it will be a liability. Um, or something like that. Y'all might be investing into some type of contract deal. I heard redefine line. Something dealing with tape or something like that. Six and six. Um, that might have significance probably in the month of June. Some type of contract, six days, six weeks, six months, or something like that. Something dealing with competition. I don't know if y'all trying to sign something that's other people out there. I heard pay attention to some type of words that y'all read on a contract. If y'all sign some contract deal, some type of contract deal. I feel like it's a big investment. I don't know if it's like a house or something like that. Um, changing ad addresses or something. Six, six, six. Six, six, six. Might have significance. Y'all might need to look at that angel number. Gemini. Yeah. And five. Y'all getting a lot of five. Judgment in reverse. Something going to be blocked out first. Um, just pay attention to the red, the, the fine lines. You know how we read something, you got a little bit of words. Read that shit. Read that shit. Because it's going to have something over your money or something like that. Maybe a home that you're trying to buy. Um, I heard it's going to put you in a situation or a bind or something like that. So just pay attention. I heard trust it. Trust whatever your intuition is telling you. Research too. I heard do some type of research as well, Gemini. Take what resonate. And I always leave the rest because this judgment in reverse keep coming out. I just show for these. And it's still coming out. Judgment, judgment in reverse. Divine intervention. Something. self examination Face reality. Somebody's going to have to face something. And that's hard. The judgment in reverse though. I know. <laughs> Mm -mm, the whistle blow the whistle. That's all I kill. He ain't know why I stopped. Cause that's all they kill saying loud and say I like that little one part on this song just sound so loud. Blow the whistle. Blow what whistle said. And then he blowing the horn. Blow the whistle. <laughs> Gemini. Let me stop. Cause it ain't funny. Whew. Okay. Give me a card for Gemini. Okay. Dearest Gemini, did you know that when you stop fighting and accepting everything exactly as it is right now, miracles start to happen? There is a freedom in the kind of radical acceptance. Let go of the unrealistic expectation and see things as they really are, not how you would like them to be. You'll be surprised at how everything seems to fall into place. When you refuse to accept things, life gets messy. You act messy and your world stays in chaos, tension, and disarray. But don't try to force a change or manipulate circumstances. 
Instead, learn about what is in front of you and face it and with your eyes fully open. Baby, what? Spirit scam me, y'all. I be telling y'all. Y'all see that shit? And this card is really saying the same thing that judgment in reverse came out two times. Okay. Then um, you can decide, stay or go, sink or swim. Wait, I'm finna go. Then I say somebody would have, Lord have mercy. I don't know who this is that getting on that boat, but baby, cover that whole entire ship. You hear me? Or the boat. I don't know what they getting on. Move or stay still. Acceptance is the key to freedom and open the doors to real opportunities. Waiting to discover. Set yourself and feel um, free. Loving you so much. Always and forever, Gemini. Oh, spirit. That scared me. They scared me. You guys. I know unpredictable. <laughs> I wanted to cruise. Or... I, I, me too. I be wanting to cruise too. too. I, oh, I get shit like this. I, uh, spirit, I ain't trying to fly my way to heaven. No spirit. But then they spot you can't be scared. I know that's real. I know that's real, but hell no. Nah. <laughs> and that shit ain't even saying it, but it's true. I'm, I'm for real. Like, I don't know what's going to go on with a boat or somebody's going to have to pay attention to their kids. But you know things happen. When you, especially when you got little kids and you ain't taught them properly how to swim. You ain't taught them properly on nothing about the water. None of that shit. And then the little children be spontaneous. They want to run out there and jump in the water like they crazy. And if you're on a boat, you don't know. You don't know. You don't know. And yes, I be drinking and having fun. But you got your cheering involved. And oh, my God. Oh, Lord. Let me get up out of energy. Um, water signs. Hello. Hey, they make good money, and they make good money for a reason, but you can't predict that water. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Hold on. Um, I'm going I'm to do water signs, you guys. I appreciate you guys. I'm on water sign. I've done um earth, and I've done air. So I'm on water. I'm on water, you guys. Give me a second. Hold on. Oh my god, so I'm gonna do the water signs, you guys. I hope y'all have an amazing day. I gotta put some lotion on my hand because baby, they're gonna be ashy as hell. They're gonna be hey. Okay, so I'm on water signs, you guys. I hope y'all have an amazing day. Okay, shit. What's up, the water signs? Let me get these too. Thanks, baby. What's up? The water signs, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Water signs for Cancer Scorpio Pisces, spirit. Okay. Okay, spirit, Tris. Okay, and this is all we're going to get. So I ain't getting no more. Okay. Okay, spirit. One more. Okay. One more. Okay. Okay, that one too. Okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> all right uh water sign so we got peaceful resolution you guys okay some of y'all being called to have some type of peaceful resolution dang i don't know if some of y'all like fried chicken but baby oh i want some so bad okay that shit just came out of the blue meditation brings answers 
I feel like y'all are looking for something to uh, balance your life out. Maybe y'all having some issues with somebody. Um, somebody making it hard for y'all. Y'all to put yourself in a situation that y'all feel like y'all can't really uh, get up out of. Or somebody's making it hard for you to get up out of. Some type of chaos energy. The number three might have some type of significance. Um, water signs. Self-acceptance. Maybe y'all are trying to learn how to self yourself. Hmm. Somebody's meant to call, um, get their own. Or maybe that's what y'all trying to do. Um, water sign trust. Um, y'all gonna have to learn how to trust some type of issue. I feel like y'all counting on too many people. Y'all trying to ride other people's waves or something like that, but you ain't getting nowhere. Water sign, you are the way. So why is you riding somebody away? Uh, inner child healing, denial. Some y'all was denying, or maybe somebody y'all deal with is denying that they need some type of inner child healing. You know what I'm saying? That's why they kept putting themselves in these conflicts. They kept trying to go by the book, but their book is wasn't the book that they was reading. They was up here trying to do what everybody else do. Instead of doing what they needed to do, water sign, take a resume and always eat the rest. I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. Who? Of you. The inner healing. The inner child healing that you needed. Or something like that. Trust. I accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly in something. That's something that y'all looking at. Y'all was listening to other people's voices and not your own water signs. So now you're being pushed to listen to your own chaos and conflict. Get up out of that shit. Spiritual growth. I mean, grow up, you know, one year from now. It's going to take somebody a year of time. And I guess, you know, it don't take you like one day to heal. It don't take you one day to break yourself down. So it's it, it going to take more than one day to heal. Um, I don't know if y'all was looking for some type of quick remedy on something water sign but you know it's not gonna work that way some of y'all gonna take this whole year whole year 2024 is gonna take for y'all this still the beginning y'all still got time take what resonates it's 11 11 on my clock okay water signs okay water signs okay water signs okay spirit okay 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 water signs okay let's jump into it then okay scorpio <sighs> Scorpio, sun, moon, rise, and take what resonates. And I always leave the rest. What's up with this spiritual growth, though? I want to know. I want to know with the spiritual growth for the Scorpio, the enlightenment phase. Y'all trying to deny this shit. I don't know if some of y'all starting to see some of the auras or something like that. Or maybe y'all can see the colors in people. Or something that with the colors being brightened. Maybe that's the new energy that's coming in. Or maybe y'all just afraid of the shit that y'all seeing. Maybe y'all can see. You know how people say that they see like the darkness in people. Um, You can really do see that. I heard eyes. Gateway to the eyes. Somebody got some beautiful eyes. Something dealing with somebody's eyes. Somebody looking in. And people's eyes now. Seeing some shit. Getting scared. Or what they see, Scorpio. Who you? Your ass getting fucking scared. Take what resonates. And I always leave the rest. Lack of planning, lack of progress. Your misery. Mm, wasting their talent. God said, if you waste your talent, he'll take it away. Maybe some of y'all got a guiltful thing, y'all. Y'all probably can't handle it or something like that. Or you feel like you can't do it by yourself. The Ten of Pentacles in reverse. You know, page and 10 is 11. 11, 11 might have some type of significance. Or the number 11, number 33. Water sign Scorpio, financial failure, loneliness. They showed me that card, but I ain't want to pull the card. You know, you know, lonely came out over here. Okay, and one of these goddamn cards. Actually, I see it. Yes, I see it. Yup, guilt. Yup, counsel clear and release. Holy love, Scorpio. Okay, what holy love spirit that they deny? That they deny in themselves. In themselves. The best love is to sell love. self acceptance you. But you can't accept you when you keep trying to get other people to see you. How they supposed to see you. Something dealing with the world. They said. Um, Y'all know how that saying go. Be in the world and not live it. However that shit go. Emotionally aloof. Uh, imagination. A lack of, lack of imagination. Doing something you'll later regret. Somebody feel like. I don't know. Somebody missed the opportunity. They feeling like they missing opportunity. Missing an opportunity. The healing part. Um, I feel like that's what somebody need to start. But they don't know how to start. How to trust this. How to trust themselves. It's questionable. They can trust other people, but can't trust themselves. Ain't that about a bitch? Hey, hello, gratitude. I appreciate y'all. 
um, manipulative, poor leadership, attention seeker, intolerance, emotionally manipulative, moody, uh, Scorpio. Somebody might be moody around you. You might be moody, feeling like a failure, feeling like a karma, feeling like there's no, I heard there is no use. Somebody um, is being called to work on themselves, attention to detail. Maybe this person feel like they got to be perfect in order to for them to be whole. And that's not it. We are all imperfect, baby. It says self-acceptance. You looking at yourself for who you really are. And somebody don't want to look at themselves like that. They feel guilty. They feel grief. They, they feel pain. I release all, any belief that no longer exists in my soul's growth. See, that's their spiritual growth, their soul's growth. They can't grow because they it's, it's other people's belief. Their belief matter more than mine is what I'm hearing. <laughs> What's a year from now, spirit? What's the conflict? Yeah, a year from now. Yeah. Bad luck. Damn. Disappointment. Stuck. Yeah, a year from now. Baby, if you don't choose yourself, what you expect? Scorpio, conflict. Y'all choosing conflict and chaos a lot. And y'all know. And I ain't trying to talk about it later. I don't fit to talk about it. Because at the end of the day, they want to be calling me all the time. She be doing stuff to other people, right? And then she'll call me to see how it's going to work out. Like, how would you intentionally do something to somebody? And then you expect some type of different outcome. Maybe y'all doing this. Maybe something that you're doing or you supposed to be doing differently. But you keep investing in the wrong things. And you think something good going to come up out of this shit. So, <laughs> nope. I heard trust whatever seed you planted, Scorpio, will be y'all y'all harvest. Bad luck, negative forces, out of control, vicious stuck cycle, disappointment, feeling low, uh, a creative block, irresponsible, uh, manipulative. This energy, these people, this situation you are in, manipulating the fuck out of your destiny. You can't get it. That's why this shit is in reverse. Okay. Y'all, Chris Brown saying a little too loud, just see. Yes, <laughs> spirit. That might be the issue too, uh, Scorpio. Okay. Need to finish what you started. Somebody needs to finish something that they started, but they ain't. They they supposed to be done. Okay. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. I'm finna get out of that song though. Oh, uh, Scorpio. Disappointed, yo, you disappointed because some damn y'all let the devil trick y'all up out of some punishment, egotistic, the sun. Y'all can't see the light because you can't see your soul, you can't see this hope, this load of vitality, uh, this clarity, this understanding, the, the like somebody's conscious mind. You know how they say when your mind is married, when you were married in a marriage with your subconscious and your conscious mind, they work together, whatever you're building within yourself, you got to heal in order for you to get that type of balance. Um, maybe you're not healing to get that balance maybe renew your mind refresh learn something different or something like that put yourself in different situation get up uh, you know from around the people that is blocking you somebody is around people that's blocking you maybe their mindset is meshing with yours water sign it's reason y'all dark milky water for a reason you can't see shit down up i mean come on you'll lose your way and i feel like somebody is losing their way out here chaos and comfort is everywhere you ain't even got no friends to really trust is what I'm hearing. <laughs> Look, oh my God, spirit, fake romance. Oh my God. I know spirit. That shit tough, Scorpio. But it seems like sometimes you put yourself in that situation, baby. Searching for so. That's what you need to be looking for. Your motherfucking self. But you're having a hard time seeing it. Got people and telling you one thing. And you try to see something else in there. I can't see it. Spirit, damn it. I'm trying to see who I am. But I can't because these people keep telling me I ain't there. <laughs> Yo, I know, right? <laughs> Burnt out. I, I know refusing to face opponents. I don't finna go spirit because you ain't fin Scorpio. It is what it is. Okay, ain't none of my business. But let me get up out of this energy. I done spent too long on y'all asses. And I gotta go. Well, what's up with the little with the Scorpio spirit? My ass getting thirsty. Scorpio. Okay, chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. Where y'all going, Scorpio? Uh how can y'all love somebody? Okay, passion. Y'all got some passion for somebody, bitch. Who y'all listen after? Listen, bitch. Y'all listen or something like that. New love. Oh, oh, spirit. Some of y'all want that new love. Y'all feel like somebody's a gift or something like that. Y'all want to marry somebody something to that nature. Maybe at one point y'all would deal with a false person. Maybe y'all ain't got locked up. Oh, 
because maybe y'all married a false ass person. <clears throat> and then, I feel like that's the part though. The reason y'all started being married somebody, a fake ass person compared to that new little y'all want. Y'all want somebody different, but y'all don't know how to sell to that person because y'all know what y'all done been through. This relationship y'all just love this ex. Somebody that wasn't doing something right, Scorpio. <laughs> somebody put you in prison. Maybe y'all went to jail behind somebody. Y'all were fighting over somebody or something doing with your mind was stuck. Y'all mingling with the wrong people. And that shit had you fucked up, Scorpio. You know what I mean. Trust y'all. Y'all having a hard time trusting. What's up with this trust? This shit came out here two times. This situation is calling for you to have faith. Hmm. Y'all might with y'all might was in a connection where y'all thought y'all could have faith in that person, but y'all learning new. Okay, that shit went real. Y'all had to learn how to face people because somebody was trying to tell you what to do, uh Scorpio. Um finance and career, high honor, message. Yeah, they kill trying to tell you how to be great. And them people didn't even know how to lead you. They couldn't even they, they if they had a roadmap to what water was, baby, they wouldn't be able to find it because they were just that off, baby. You must supposed to be these folks, Scorpio. Woo, let me get up out y'all energy because I Oh, spirit. Um, what's up with that money, though? What's up with the Scorpio money, though? What's up with the Scorpio money? I hope y'all have an amazing day. Hello, everyone. Y'all put y'all zodiacs in for me. I'm almost done with water. No, I'm not. I got um Pisces and Cancer. Okay. And then I'm doing fire. And that, then I'll be done. I done did everything else. Okay. Scorpio, did resonate. Let me know. Shit, what's up with the money? What's up with the Scorpio money sphere? Oh, that's why they say it look a little funny. It might be. Ten of Cups. Uh, I feel like some of y'all going to have to work a little bit hard for some reason, though. I don't feel, I feel like somebody was presented with a mountain. Maybe you don't know how to overcome this mountain, move the mountain. You know, they say if you got faith, you can tell, cast that mountain into the sea. And I know y'all probably don't know what the damn sea, how you be able to cast a mountain and all this shit. Now, nah, yeah, it's your faith. According to your faith, it will be done. Ten of cups, that's abundance, though. Um, maybe some of y'all look for all around abundance, like the health, the wealth, the people and all that. Maybe y'all feel like y'all can't get it. Um, maybe y'all not working for it. Faith without works is dead, score. Scorpio, maybe y'all working too much, but not having faith that God can be able to bring it in or your higher self or whatever. Maybe you don't feel like you could be able to bring it in. Maybe you don't feel like you're worthy enough for this, but it's all according to your mindset, Scorpio. Take a resonate. And I always need rest. Oh, I got one more. That was flipped over. The arts is right. Faith without works is dead. Mm -hmm. And some of y'all are seeing the naked truth. Mm-hmm. Somebody y'all some of y'all is really working so hard but not seeing fruits of your labor or something like that. And again, it's all about who you working with. And then y'all don't believe shit. You don't feel worthy, no. You don't feel like you can attract this. Keep pushing. I know that's real. They're gonna have to. <laughs> In order to see this good energy, this softer living life. Um, instead of closing that shit out, being abundance, but you know, some people just resist their change. They resist what that that calling that whatever they prayed on that close the door. I don't want that. I don't, I don't know what to do with that or something like that. Or it don't look like it's true or they can't trust it because what they done been through. Like when you gotta heal, you gotta heal. Cause if you don't heal, you gonna be able. You gonna push everything good that's away from you. Cause you too scared. You was trusting the wrong people. That devil energy. They say devil give gifts too. So you thinking that that guilt that go on the devil brought you was something from the most high, but it wasn't. It was there to teach you the lesson, and you didn't learn the lesson. You you pushed yourself in the corner because the devil blessed you with something you thought it was from God. Now ain't that song? It let you know you don't know yourself or nothing. No, like when your intuition kept telling you that something was too good to be true, that that in that situation it was. But some of y'all expect some great shit up out of something that wasn't even. It's a failure, baby. It's a failure. You 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 just dealing with karmas. The devil just came and blessed you with things like how most singing, right, Mo? Everybody ain't your friend. I said that shit the other day. When you get fucked up, Scorpio, y'all seeing some shit now. Y'all pushing things away. The good things at that because you're scared. You got to heal. They say heal your inner child. It's the reason you need to heal your inner child. Some of y'all feel lonely out here too. And for what? For what? Because you got to look at the people that had to fall out the situation you was in. They had to go for a reason. You feel lonely because them people ain't around you. That's a blessing. I'd rather attract the right people and with the right purpose to come into my life. 
what I would what I look like he's uh feeling some type of way about some shit like like in the child healing you a bond with the wrong people because you want to feel a selfie. That's what you gotta heal. Why you got a need of feeling accepted to the wrong people when you when you are good when you you can be by yourself and when you be by yourself you will learn how to love on yourself and when you're by yourself you learn how to love on yourself you'll start to attract the people that love you just as much as you love yourself. Okay, okay, that's the problem. It's the self part you you having a hard time with Scorpio. Hard time, baby. Hard time. Okay, spirit. Dear Scorpio, everything is in divine order. Even in chaos, there is order. We are always in all this. For you, though, on your human journey, things can get disorganized in your mind and physical reality. You need to get rid of the clutter, whether it be too many stories in your mind, too many what ifs or fearful thoughts of the past or futures. Spirit, y'all just be scared of me. Okay, Spirit, let me get up out this energy up. Instead, focus on now. <laughs> Empty your mind, clean your house, throw out any object that tells you uh, uh you an uncomfortable story. Discern what you have, sort, purge, clear, and organize. What sort, purge, and clear? Okay. Okay, spirit. And organize. We want you to have space to fill with something better. Oh my god, spirit is so fun. Feel okay, spirit. Okay, spirit loves a vacuum as it gives space for brilliant new energy. Let go of what it um is not serving you and give order to what remains. See them and know their value. <laughs> your soul needs organization in order to keep your connection to us and to spirit free of the distractions. You are so adored by so many. We love you. Um we hope you really know that Scorpio. Damn, they they just really repeated exactly what what these cards said, baby. What even in chaos there is order, baby. It's a reason. Sometimes it look like God just tear you down the things that's breaking down your life. You feel by yourself. It was a reason, Scorpio. You gotta cleanse your energy. I heard it cleanse your palate because your taste all fucked up. <laughs> hey, spirit. Gratitude, your taste all messed up, Scorpio, and you want to feel by yourself. Okay, you feel by yourself at this time that you need so you can learn what you need to heal within you because there's something in you that you 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 kept holding on to the wrong. But well, let me get up out there. Ain't nobody. Let me start talking over these cards, spirits, because it ain't none of my business. Ain't none of my business. Hey, Pisces. Hold on, let me cleanse my. Let me cleanse my palate, Pisces. Cause I know y'all don't want this shit be bleeding over. Okay? Majority of it is, okay? Because I'm keeping these called Pisces. Okay. Hey, that's my shit right up. Hey, okay. Hey, okay, Pisces. That, that's y'all right up. All the way. Here I go. Ah! Y'all my Pisces because he just give me so much fire. Yeah, he a fucking water sign. Baby, what? I have to sit with that dude every time I feel low. It's just his, his sarcastic energy. It's just him. He being truthful. Here I go. I know. Hey, show up and show out. You hear me? Pisces. Okay, let me clean this off. Woo, spirit. Let me turn it down. Son, cause baby, they gonna get me in my feelings. Pisces. Y'all know people be trying, y'all. Here I go. Here I go. Y'all are a mess. You hear me? They be talking about Aries. I don't think Aries like the Pisces, baby. They say the Pisces is the last one of the zodiac. And then we usher into the Aries, the head. Pisces is the feet. Pisces gonna get you somewhere. You hear me? You hear me? Dad, come back. That's the Pisces. Y'all are the last on the zodiac. Okay. And then here we go with the Aries. Okay. I think y'all, y'all, y'all just be waking on Aries up, and I'm just being real. I'm I'm, I'm just telling y'all what I studied a little bit. Okay. Okay. Yeah, but look at the chart. I think Pisces is number 12. And then they start over with the Aries. Okay. Okay, so this song is befitting. Okay. Oh my God. Okay, let me get out of that energy. Hold on, y'all. Let me refresh Pisces. How are y'all feeling? Is Adam honest? Uh uh uh. I feel like Adam is holding back some shit. 
So now I'll take with Rizzle and I always leave the Rizzle. Hello, how are you? Y'all talk the screen to show my your pressure. I'm somebody. I know where to go when I need some of that pressure. For real. Because me being out here on that platform, sometimes I have to get a little bit in my feelings. And he come through and he apply so much pressure, y'all. When, when me and him used to do counter work together, he would be the fire starter and he'll fucking water. He, how this counter was when I first got on the camera, how that counter was like this high. He was that tight. He almost burnt on my house twice because he come with so much energy. Like, literally. He, we were sitting in the car, y'all, and talking. His whole side of the car had frosted up the window, but my shit was clear. That's just how much he, he come with. Pressed up, for real. And it's sad he be entertaining the wrong people. I be wanting to suck the shit out of that nigga. Like, nigga, you got all this knowledge. All this energy. All this, whoever you is, period. Big pressure. But you damn it down for other wrong people. That's the problem, Pisces. Now, when y'all standing to y'all calling who y'all are, y'all really start to see the potential. Y'all really start to see the power within y'all. Y'all are beasts. You hear me? Y'all are the end. The tail. Y'all the tail, but y'all the motherfucking head all at the same time. Y'all like y'all school people. You school people. Like how they say the beginning of the tarot is the baby. You know, the number one. That's the baby. Like how Nikki be saying, y'all are my sons. Okay, Pisces, I really see y'all like that. But y'all, you know, just the people. Y'all be teaching some motherfuckers, you know what I mean? But you have to teach some to yourself too. Y'all apply that much pressure on other people, but you apply it on yourself. And it be kind of sad though. They said y'all are two. Y'all like two fishes. One, one go this way, one go that way. Your higher self is that pressure. And then that other fish that take you all the way down. Sometimes you go down so far, you'll drown yourself. I see. It's a beautiful thing if you know how to balance it out. Yo, yo, dumb that low. Because y'all, like my cousin said, he was like, we could be the best one or we could be the craziest ones. And I was like, I, I could tell. But y'all got love like no other. My daughter is a Pisces. One of my daughters is a Pisces. Right. Look, stand up. Spirit, stand up. Who y'all going against? Let me go and get into that reading, Pisces. Stand up. I say that. He say that, yo. Okay. Okay. So these. Hey, stand up. Now I don't like what y'all be saying, but y'all pressure though. Okay, Spirit. What's up with the Pisces? And what? Let me stand up. Some of y'all might be calling somebody out too. Or somebody might be calling y'all out, Pisces. Um, maybe y'all be getting into some, some type of altercation with somebody. I hope not. No, some type of altercation with somebody. Um, maybe somebody that you used to deal with, hang with. This person don't appreciate how you talking, walking now, or something like that. They might you know how people say you think you better than them or something like that, Pisces. Take what resonate. You know that you're never alone. Maybe people look at you and might be calling you lonely. Nobody want to fuck with you. But I feel like you appreciate this silence. I heard silence is golden. Something is golden golden with you. Some of y'all will pop off or something like that. Some of y'all do not respond back to these allegations. I feel like somebody is accusing you of something or something like that. Uh, Pisces, take what resonate. And I always leave the rest. Something dealing with you standing by yourself, solution or something like that. Um, somebody probably call you a problem. Hmm. They watch you. Somebody judge you too from a distance. Uh, you irritate a lot of people. Something dealing with your energy. Um, you, you, you. I heard interrogation. Somebody probably try to be in your business. You don't let them know your business. I heard you keep it to yourself or something like that. Um, these people get mad because they want to know what you got going on, but you don't let them know. Like you don't let people in too close to you or something like that. Maybe y'all had to learn differently. It was just maybe you was entertaining the wrong. Is what I'm hearing. Ten of cups. Some of y'all are building that. Somebody probably feel like you can't build it. And I feel like you're not entertaining people, Pisces. Take what resonates. And I always eat the rest. Somebody feel like you being unfair to them. I don't know what you said or something like that. Or maybe somebody said something to you that got up on your skin. It started fucking with you or something like that. Somebody put you in a certain energy. Um, maybe you feel a certain type of way. Your intuition went off. Your antennas went up. Uh, pressure a point. Somebody's just you trying to keep it cordial, something like that. Mm, but somebody, I don't know, maybe you feel like somebody's trying to bully you, they try to bully you, or maybe they call you a bully. Pisces, I guess you just 
I heard filter. You have no filter. You don't put nothing on your tongue. You don't dim down something. Something like that. Take what resonate. My light irritates they demons. I know that's real. It, it feel like that. It feel like that because when you when you when they say you don't know what come behind me, I feel like y'all know y'all are not alone. <laughs> you can tell when you're not alone, um, because your intuition, your spirit feels different. You feel like you got a lot of energy behind you. You do, but you know a lot of people that's in this 3D, they always think, well, I look like I got power if I got a lot of people with me. Not all the time, not all the time, you know. You know, you ain't got to be around a lot of crowd of people to prove who you are. I keep seeing like this scene with somebody walking in a building with people behind them. But them people ain't, they, they like, I don't know, it's the, the vibe that these people, yo, know, that energy. Uh, you know how you walking in a, a club or something, you got a lot of people behind you, but it's somebody that's in their energy, though, they can't be trusted. They cannot be trusted. They press probably move a little funny or something like that. They are unreliable. They might be toxic. They like starting mess. Or maybe they saying this about you, Pisces. Take what resonate and I always leave the rest. What's up with the Pisces love? Let me get up out of it. Woo, Pisces. Lord have mercy. Chaos and comfort. I know that's real. A lot. You hear me? A lot. I heard y'all go hard for people that y'all kill bad. And so don't be expecting that for no people, though. They don't mean they gonna do it. Well, somebody don't show the same amount of love or something like that. I don't know. We got Cupid's arrow, ascending, and engagement ring, and X. Stop the pattern, union, partnership, um, um, learning, expansion, new phase, transcending, have faith, love is coming. Some of y'all just, I don't know, y'all just give the people and think people supposed to give back to you like that, and they don't. And they don't. And they won't. T and I guess y'all are learning that. Sabotage, rebuilding, interrogation, repetitive, right, working on it. Some of y'all just work on the wrong things too much too. Pisces, stop that shit. Stop that. Oh, God, we're going to do it. Yo, the snake, competition, enemy, clever. That's the, that, you know how I said y'all walking in the club and y'all got people behind y'all. Y'all got people that follow y'all. Y'all got people that watch y'all. Y'all got people. It's kind of like you can say trends if you want to, Pisces, for real. But it's just who you entertaining. So I feel like y'all entertain the snakes. Okay. What's up with the money in the Pisces spirit? Let me get some my cards. What we going to get for Pisces then? What y'all talking about? Okay. But it ain't enough for me. Okay, see, my daddy's slow that song, baby. I can tell my daddy come around, baby. Hear me, you hear me? Cause this the song right here. I love it. You hear me? He used to sing that. That's how I knew where I got my singing voice from my daddy. Cause my mom can't sing well. Shit, you hear me? Her, I thought she could sing, but no, her throat is busted. <laughs> no. And then my dad will say one day, he was saying, it is so, I got to say, because you smoke that in the weed, that good gun, you baby. Baby, baby. My dad, okay. It's the vibe from that nigga. He was a Sagittarius. My dad was the shit. You know me, and he knew it. Oh, uh, give me a card uh, for that money, Pisces money. Pisces money. What's up with the Pisces spirit? Come on now, we okay. The magician, as usual, and the will of fortune. Okay, Pisces. Hey, y'all been not letting these people take y'all investments and, and play with y'all now about y'all money, y'all energy. This energy is precious because I feel like that's your money, that's your currency, Pisces. I heard some of y'all need to bet on y'all, so y'all need to start something different or something like that. Y'all might do transition phase, be by yourself, build somebody else, so you got everything you motherfucking need as above, so below. Okay, as within, so without. But you know the people that coming in behind you, okay, they gonna, they coming in with their daggers. Okay, and I feel like you know that. <laughs> you know that. Yo, you do, Pisces. Ain't that your card? Okay. I be damned you get high off me for free. Yo, they gonna get high off your ass for free. Okay. Let me get up out of that. 
and guzzle it because I know the weed in my system is getting lonely. I know that's real spirit. Okay, Pisces. Spirit. Which I gonna tell Pisces. Okay. Break up separation. Stop a pattern. Stop it. Okay, hold on, Nicole. Falling out. I'm gonna take over. Fuzzy Pisces. Dearest Pisces, we are sending you waves of love and joy as we watch you reap the rewards of your tenacity and faith. We know how love, wait, we know how long it has taken you to reach some of your goals and that you have disappointed along the way, disappointments along the way. Right now, we suggest that you take a deep breath and fill yourself up with gratitude and tune into the vibration of well-being. Temporary conditions may be trying to hypnotize you into seeing something else as your reality, but we know your that happy reward, rewards are on their way um, to you even now. Change is the only constant, so be open to it. You will achieve your dreams and more, we promise. But more important, your happy rewards will be gathered up in the small moments, the gentle breezes, the soft kisses, and the quiet commitments. Your happiness moments will be on the journey of itself, not in arriving at any destination. You are surrounded by so much love and care. Can you feel us? Can you? Can you, Pisces? Can you feel it? Up? I know that's real. I'd be scared when you can't feel your ancestors and shit. When they say you are not alone, baby, they ain't playing. I'm right here, baby. I'm right here. And they be moving some stuff for you, too. They really do. Who I got to do? Cancer. Cancer. Hold on. Let me take a little break. That was beautiful. I claim. I appreciate you. I know that's real. Straight like that. Pash. I know that's real. Okay, spirit. So, we finna do cancer. Hold on. Let me get something drunk. Boy, I've been up here so long. How long have I been up here? Too goddamn long. I'm determined to finish this reading. I got to do fire sign after cancer and I will be done. Okay. I got good charge up here. I appreciate you guys. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. So I'm finna do cancer. So cancer, remember this is down here, right? But I feel something dealing with denial to cancer. I acknowledge my fear and replace it with the insight of awareness. That's it, cancer. I feel like it's something in you that you're supposed to be trusting. Whew. What is this? Okay, Queen B. So you best take he shall I proceed? Yes, indeed. Okay, Cancer. Oh, y'all gonna make me high. Hold on. Okay, Cancer. Hold on, let's listen this a little bit. A year from now, okay. I know, right, Kelsey? I said y'all back to be high. Oh, my God. A natural high, Kelsey. I know that's real. Oh, my God. I feel it. Y'all vibrations, though. She. Okay. She. Okay, the elevation. Let me get up by that. Hold on. Heard me on the radio, all this. Okay, you from now. Y'all gonna be in there, huh, Council? Okay, let's turn that down, cause baby. <laughs> Wait, what the cancers? Back in town, cause get a bad Okay. In a bra or see. Okay, Council, what is this? I acknowledge my fear and I replace it with the inside of awareness. Some of y'all could deny y'all. So some of y'all could deny some type of journey, delaying some type of journey, delaying some type of uh, elevation or something. Shall I proceed? Yes. Okay. Okay, high priestess, divine feminine, highly sexual, intuitive, mystic, higher purpose, higher power, subconscious mind, sacred knowledge. Some of y'all could deny that part of you. Some of y'all kept denying or maybe y'all were dealing with people that killed you in situations where you didn't see that, you know what I'm saying? The ten of wands in reverse. Um, this energy of some of y'all finna be world renowned or something like that. Capricorn. I'm at cancer. Some of y'all might be dealing with a Capricorn. Damn spirit. No, because cancer. Cancer. Some of y'all are really uh somebody is known worldwide, or y'all gonna be elevating, traveling the world. 
start traveling some things, taking yourself somewhere, speaking on some things or something like that. Ace of Cups, new love, new marriage, birth. Fill me up until I overflow. Divine gifts inspired. Some of y'all will be inspired to do better. New levels, new doubles is what I have. Counsel, something dealing with the H, B, and J, the initials. Might have significance with it, though. Little delay you, resistant change, poor timing, late start, eight of ones in reverse. New levels, new devils. Maybe you was dealing with the same devil, some energy that kept trying to bound you or something to that nature. Uh, seven of cups, uh, with the knight of cups, choices. Um, something like how she say you want a cheap chick, you better go down there to freak me. Uh, negative, uh, ace of pentacles in reverse. Your lover, some lover. Um, maybe I was dealing with some lover. I don't know, somebody kept holding you up. You can see it. Um, maybe you got bored with this person. Maybe you moved on from this person. Mm -hmm. I heard they weren't equaling out no more. Somebody didn't equal. They didn't amount. They, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Almost like somebody was trying to pretend like they would, but you know they didn't amount. You know, conflict with this connection, this relationship, whatever this shit is, that kept you from elevating. I feel like once you released it, like you, 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 you had to. Shit, it got me stuttering. A bitch damn speed yo somebody had to reject something get somebody though this person was weighing you down something like that um cancer friends with benefits i heard that with a person probably was friend with benefits baby they were benefiting them but it wasn't benefiting you is what i'm hearing cancer cancer let me look in a little because that's too long for you What's up, Dick Cancer? What card you want me to get? Let me get this one. Oh, uh, I don't, I don't react with somebody. I don't mention your name. It says it's time to heal now, Cancer. Maybe I'll fail for something or somebody. Cause that's what I'm hearing. Something, somebody. There, I heard that ways was temporary, something like that. Some type of soulmate that you were dealing with. Trust. We all keep getting trust. Why y'all keep getting trust? Y'all, this situation is called for you to have faith. Uh, I felt that the inner voice will always guide me correctly. Some of y'all inner voice was guiding y'all correctly to love yourself first. Your self respect makes you more romantically attractive. Um, maybe this person is soulmate that you was with, then you know they wasn't romantically attracted. Um, it made you try to see some positive and you know, you know, positive thinking, faith will bring you romance. You was hoping <laughs> maybe somebody was making it hard, despair, toil, and labor, and privileged lady, bad health, expectations. You had the wrong expectation and something or somebody, baby. Wrong with expectation. I'm a private little. I know that's real spirit. And it's just the occupation. Um, that was a burden. Okay, you were dealing with a burden. That's all. I know that's real spirit. Let me turn it down a little bit. Take what race night and I always leave the race. What else I got to do with the money? The money and the cancer spirit. The money and the cancer. The money and the cancer. Okay. Hmm. Something that was somebody occupation to. I don't know if you expect somebody to work with you or something like that. I feel like it's somebody that you connected to or connected, or you might have felt this way to be pampered, or somebody wants to be pampered. They feel like they should anyway. <laughs> they don't put in no work. I'll talk no action, some type of shit like that. Five of ones. Mm -hmm. They're like little queen of coins. I know that's real spirit. But in right, cancel what? Yeah, that five of ones is that motherfucker right there. You know, you know how people be trying to put on the image, but they don't deserve that image that they be trying to put on, you know, pretend like they got it like that, something like that. But it's not that. Okay. Nine of swords in reverse, the queen of coins, the nine of ones, yo. Yeah. Um, uh, six of coins and the tower. Strength in reverse, the money you putting somebody will be putting all their time and money into somebody, or some it's like you pouring into somebody and they can't pour into you back. 
deplete you almost draining energy somebody's draining maybe you have to block this person off a lot or maybe this person might be in competition with you their energy is defeating dragging or something like that take what resonate and always lead the rest hello you guys i hope y'all have an amazing day and this is cancer you guys this is the last of the water signs and then i'll be on the um fire sign if y'all want me to jump back into another um zodiac you can donate and i can i surely will and i'm looking at my cash show so whenever you send it i see that you're be on the list and i'll go back okay all right or for you know all right spirit so okay I already said about the money, and I said about a little. Let me get a card for the council. Occupation. Okay, spirit. Somebody need to uh, make sure they check, they keep their health in order, too. I heard stay up to date on your doctor's visit. Maybe your intake, food consumption, whatever you're eating. Pay attention to what you eat. I appreciate you. Hello, Cancer. Hello, you guys. I hope y'all have an amazing day. Um, Dearest Cancer, you know everything in the universe is perfect, in, even in, in its flaws. And we view the creation of spirit in total awe. All is unique, yet part of the unity of existence. But the human experience is a little different from ours. You tend to have a specific standard for what you consider ideal, and this isn't serving you right now. So forget your ideas of perfection and see through our eyes, allowing things to be as they are without judgment. Don't wait until a perfect moment or move to start something. Instead, enter life with all of its flawsomeness. You are exactly what you're supposed to be. Let others who um let others be who they are to imperfect, imperfect and human, uh, complex or simple. It doesn't matter for there is always something to discover, experience and love. When you drop the need for an ideal, you uncover the real treasure, which will be far more interesting in value. Um, lo loving your loving you like crazy cancer. You are magic. I know that's real. I know that's real. Cancer, you are magic. That is beautiful. I like that energy. <laughs> Fire sign. Let me clean this energy off. Fire sign. I'm almost done. Almost there. I am almost there. Okay. Hello. Fire sign. Any fire signs in the um that's watching me? Put your zodiac in the comments, you guys. I appreciate you. Oh, y'all still up here. I know I, I almost knocked that shit down. Oh my god. I don't need to shuffle that. Yes, I do. Hold on, let me clear this energy. And I need to get me some drink. See it? This motherfucking beet juice. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm almost done. Hold on, y'all. I appreciate you. I hope y'all have an amazing day. Okay, spirit. All right, what's up with the fire sign, spirit? What's up with the fire sign? We got health, power, intention. Hmm. I will honor the physical vessel that enshrines my soul. Okay, fire sign, TikTok. Um, take a step back and gain the number one. Start with self or something like that. I just seen self awareness again. Maybe I called to do that or some forgiveness. Y'all got a year for now. Some type of clean up energy, helpful people. Some of y'all might be calling in. Some type of helpful people, improving health. Y'all got health out here two times. Okay. Mm-mm. Okay, 
What's this game for the um fire sign? Which one I'm gonna do first? I'm gonna do Leo. What's up, Leo? What's up, Leo? What's up with that yang? Some of y'all might be from come Central uh, California. What's up with the yang spirit for the Leo? What's up with the yang? Okay. Dang. I feel like somebody was pushing to, I don't know, pushed out of the family or pushed out of some a situation. Um, I heard a will. I don't know if y'all have somebody that passing away or something. Some type of insurance. Um, somebody's trying to take the, uh, something from you. A state or something like that. Uh, something that was rightfully yours. I feel like somebody's trying to take something from you. Or pushing you up out of something. Um, is what I'm hearing. I see like they being pushed. Like this being pushed and this being pushed. Um, something done with time. Maybe somebody didn't tell you something in time. Um, somebody had to reevaluate something. Somebody received some type of news about their health or something like that. Um, people resonate. And now it's the uterus. I don't know if it's like y'all tried to offer some type of love to somebody. Somebody kept pouring out what you was trying to offer them. Or maybe you were expecting people to treat you differently and they're not. Um, mm, power and intention. Some of y'all is having to call y'all power back with a judgment. Um, somebody tried to, I don't know, belittle you, dishonor you or something like that. Just keep you up out of something, stress you out, call you crazy, take away something. Um, you know how when they, when you got some money coming to you, that you know they'll say, well, you're not uh, capable. Of, they'll you know they try to get you locked up. Y'all ain't heard the story where people were called, they family members were, were called uh, uh, crazy people. You know, they, they send them to the crazy house. However you want to say it. Shit. So. Just to keep somebody up out of some type of birthright, some type of money or something like that. It be lies. It's the lies. You'll keep somebody from winning something, getting an inheritance, insurance, or something like that. <laughs> Maybe it's, it's like three of them working together. They the one trying to get the money, keeping you up out of it. Maybe you are the head, and they don't want you to get some. So, Maybe these people are trying to bully you or something like that, Leo. Table resonating. I always leave the rest. What's up with the love? Um, Leo. What's up with the love for the Leo spirit? Take a resonate and I always eat a rest. Hello. Who want the smoke? <laughs> Libra. I did Libra earlier, but if you want me to skip the line, I'll go back. I'll go back. I read your energy. Um, A time to give rather than a time to take. These people trying to take for you. New moon of Virgo. Y'all might be dealing with a Virgo or something like that, Leo. The end of a tow cycle approaches. Full moon of Capricorn. Y'all might deal with a Capricorn. Luck is on your side. Sagittarius. Y'all might be dealing with a Sagittarius. Or, you know. Maybe it's something that's pushing you. Nothing is coming up out of the situation. Maybe y'all felt like this. I don't know. Is somebody trying to take something from you or pushing you up out of it? Maybe y'all was afraid that something was going not going your favor. Communication is the key. You work hard. Your hard work is paying off. Mm, it, it might be a better way to do something, Leo. It might be. Because if these people trying to take some from you, <laughs> it's like it's by the numbers, too. It's a couple of people trying to take some from one person. It's kind of it's gonna make the you know, if you have to go to court or something like that, it, it's gonna be like you know, God has some type of play on this for this to happen in my favor compared to how many people going up against me type of shit. You know, take a resonate and always lead the race. Let me get some for the money. The money for the Leo spirit. Okay. Mm, judgment. Oh my God, spirit. 
I don't know. Y'all calling some good energy, Leo. I don't know what that is. That who that was trying to come up against you, but y'all getting a second chance. Like second chance at life, second chance in your money, second chance in your finance, and then even somebody try to take something from you, it ain't gonna work. I don't know whoever this is trying to come up against you, but I don't see it happening. You know what I'm saying? They could try. Oh God, that's all they can do. Let me get a spirit card for the Leo spirit. What's up with the Leos? Ooh, I smell some good spirit. Mm, I'm hungry now. Oh, my God. How long have I been on this camera? About two hours, three hours. I appreciate you. I've been up here too long. Y'all talk to spirit. I appreciate you. Okay, Leo. Leo, dear Leo, uncertainty is the new normal for the whole world. Things are changing at a rapid pace. And the old ways we once trusted are no longer reliable. But leaving the familiar behind, leaving the familiar behind can be a good thing. When you are pushed to step into the unknown, you are pulled forward into discovering new possibilities that have been hidden in plain sight. Check in with your higher power. Your soul knows better than the small self. Have faith in the support of the higher power and the infinite potential for your life. Right now, the advice we have for you is this. Try something new. Do something different. You want to know how it feels, what it looks like, or what the outcome would be if you do not take the first step into the unknown and experience the unfamiliarity. Um, I think that's the, uh, for, uh, you'll be so glad you did because the treasure will appear. We're so proud of you for um being brave. You are loved and so supported. Celebrate life, Leo. I be trying to concentrate too much. I got two more spirits. I gotta do Sagittarius. That's what we finna do, Sagittarius. Okay. Here I go. Here I go. I know that's real, Sage. I know that's real. I tell you, I ain't heard this song so long. Here I go. Here I go. Boy, I remember my brother used to play this shit. He used to have them big ass picking. You can hear the goddamn music all the way up the road. You hear me? So I used to go and put musical on. I used to love me some musical. You hear me? And turn that bitch your light. And go out there and stand in the middle of the road. <laughs> it wasn't nobody out there but me. And I was like, here I go. <laughs> Talk about practicing. Indeed. Okay, Sagittarius. Yes. Okay, what we gonna do? What we gonna do? What we gonna do, Sagittarius? What we gonna do? We gonna do this. Sagittarius. Yes. Be ready. What up? What's up with the helpful people, Sagittarius? What's up with the helpful people? I feel like y'all gonna be building y'all the other queen of wands or something like that. Maybe y'all had to learn how to attract helpful people into your life or something to that nature. Cause maybe y'all had some people like, you know how you, you, you like to pin on your people, parents or something like that? Something like that. Somebody out their mindset. Poverty mindset. Maybe you was living with this person. Maybe you was married to this person. Maybe this person your twin flame. Or something like that. Sagittarius. Celebration. Uh, Angel of Truth. 11-11. Some of y'all are standing on. Because it's like somebody from. Maybe it was like a mother figure. Or a father figure. Something to the field house. Something to at home. Um, you guys. Determine. Some of y'all are really becoming. Um, something that your family wasn't. Is what I'm hearing. Sagittarius. Something that your people wasn't. You might be different. A black sheep or something like that. Or something like that, Sagittarius. Um, blame, unreliable, do dodginess. Some of y'all are dodging something. Some type of tower. Maybe some type of tower taught y'all something. Um, revelation, awakening, sudden changes. <sighs> the avoidance. Some of y'all had to avoid something or somebody. Somebody was disastrous or something like that. Penny pension, somebody was stingy, they might didn't have money, knowledge, or something. Maybe you're trying to build some type of free will energy within you, Sagittarius. Temperance, energy, meaning, purpose. Here I go. You are seeing their future planning, visionary decisions. You know, this tower showed you who you was, pushed you into something. 
Some of y'all appreciate this time, this fall that y'all went through. Somebody has to improve something within them. I heard restore their soul, their mind, their spirit. Something like that, Sagittarius. Yeah, some of y'all had to do that shit. Build y'all so. You know, you're a higher thing. Connect yourself to a higher power. Um, power and intentions. That, that's the helpful people that y'all attract, the Sagittarius. Yeah, ancestors, ancestral blessing, joy, happiness, energy, birthright, abundance. Um, that was pushing you. Some of y'all had to take a step back on what y'all used to do, though. He had to show you something. Passion, majesty, healing, energy, will, and determination. Sagittarius, some of y'all just got in that energy. Because I feel like at one point, y'all, you know, the retreat. Maybe y'all went on to some type of retreat. Y'all had to take yourself away from something and stop dealing with people or something to that nature. Become more self establishing who you are. You know what I'm saying? Y'all working, recognizing, talented, working with your higher vibration. Sag, it pushed you uh, on the other side. Somebody on the other side is helping you. Maybe spirit helping your power, intention. You seeing a power within you. Okay. Woo, I like it. got too deep in that reading sphere for the Sagittarius. Ghostbuster, who you gonna call? I know that's real. I know that's real. Here I go. <laughs> hey, when they do show up, that shit be funny as hell. Because it just be funny. <laughs> All right, spirit. What's up with the love for the Sagittarius? What's up with the love for the Sagittarius spirit? Past life ro romance. You known each other before. Okay, what's up with the um soulmate, adjudication, passion? Okay. Dang, true love. Is this somebody that y'all y'all feel like y'all doing with a soulmate? Y'all got somebody that y'all soulmate? Um, y'all learn how to not you control something. Maybe y'all was trying somebody trying to be in control of something wouldn't go with the flow. Spirit is trying to get you to go with the flow with this uh person. Maybe y'all been in this before with this person. Maybe y'all had to start over again. New little love yourself first. Maybe y'all had to take some type of separation from this person. Um, Sagittarius honeymoon and flirt. Maybe y'all are coming into that. Um, sudden wealth 777 and E11 community celebration. Maybe you taking away from yourself, taking yourself away from something, brought in more prosperity, brought in more, more love, brought in more chemistry. Somebody that you have fun with, somebody that you vibe with, somebody that you love, like really love this person. What's up with y'all? Money, what it say, sudden wealth. So I I really believe that though y'all calling in that um I heard being pampered Sagittarius y'all like being pampered um and y'all feel like y'all worked on y'all stuff enough uh to bring in this energy some of y'all are crafty some of y'all are doing something with y'all hands that's bringing this abundant some of y'all have connected to your divine masculine divine feminine energy and it's gonna bring in this abundance. Y'all might work together. I heard a power couple. Y'all might be in that energy to bring in this abundance. You know, y'all might be stepping in that energy stage to bring in that abundance. Something done with fruitful season, city. Um, somebody might be the king or queen of the city or something like that. King, prom queen, king, something like that. Something like that. Table resonate. Let me get a message for the Sagittarius. I heard y'all love like we'll be looking so hopeful soon. It's like y'all gonna be marrying y'all best friend and y'all divine counterpart. Power couple for real. <laughs> and it said that so many times with the full ones came out here that many times. Okay, spirit. Sagittarius. Hello, you guys. I hope you have an amazing day. Dear Sagittarius, what is true for you? Can you be impeccable with your words? Sure you can. As long as it's not used to manipulate others. The truth can set everyone free. Let go of the results. Let go of your fears. Allow the truth to empower you and others. This will set into motion a kind of change that will be supportive of you and loving and all kinds of prosperous. This is not a time to compromise and hide your truth from others. 
whatever it is you want go for and be clear in your motives especially with yourself you will be so happy you did there is a time where you can tap into the power to co-create and manifest your best life doesn't that feel amazing sagittarius and the results miraculous when you tell the truth and ask the same of others you can learn a lot from life's bountiful lessons and achieve your dreams sagittarius love you always what did it say you're magical okay y'all know that some of y'all are earth, earth angels and y'all know that sagittarius and the people that you're around know that too. But some people just don't know how to take you. So it is what it is. Okay, Aries. Ooh, I made a spirit. I sure did. Aries, let me clear the energy. Hold on. I hope y'all have an amazing day. Any Aries in here? Aries, that's my last and final one. Okay. I done made it all the way to the end, y'all. Any other time, I would have dealt the fight on. So when I get tired, y'all, I'll be sad. You hear me? Doing these readings take some out of me. And I got to sit here in one spot. <laughs> and I'm hungry. And I got to use the bathroom again. I'm drinking all that dang beet juice. Okay. Okay, so we're going to keep this right here, Aries. And we're going to focus on your energy personally. You know what? Let me get this. What is this? Twist the what? Because I remember this song. Overnight celebrities. Okay, Aries. Sun, moon, rise. And Aries, say what it resonates. And I always leave the rest. Leave the rest. Mm. Maybe some of y'all will be in that energy though. Or maybe somebody keep that name in your mouth or no for something like that. Maybe y'all got somebody to talk about y'all or something like that. I heard recognition Aries or something like that. Y'all might deal with somebody named Jerry. Or you know somebody named Jerry or something like that. A name with a J on it. Table resonate and I always read the read. Some of y'all have to unsubscribe from somebody or unfriend somebody or something like that. Maybe people are talking about you enough. Oh, uh, every. <laughs> Something dealing with colors too. Um, you see somebody true colors, Aries. Okay, Aries. I feel like the way these people talk about you, it's like you ain't did no good for these people. Something like that. For some of y'all, y'all feel like y'all been hit with some type of love bug too, Aries. Or maybe y'all thought y'all was in love with somebody. Something doing with blue sapphire, that color might have significance. Some of y'all might be a coach. Table resonate. And I always leave the race. What's up with the Aries? What's up with Aries? What's up with this um type of still bad? Power and intention. What's up? Okay. Bold, energetic, passionate, lustful, travel, home, and work driven. Mm, undeliverable, all talk, no action, know it all, gossip, promise, lies, um, mentally restless. Y'all had somebody had to take some type of step back. Somebody, something wasn't being delivered. Um, maybe somebody was saying that they could deliver something. Maybe y'all ordered something. Maybe somebody was just, uh, they couldn't stand on a whatever they were speaking about. Um, foolish, unproductive, um, materialism, hoarding. Take yourself back. Some of y'all had to call y'all power back to recover something. Maybe some of y'all got in an accident too, near death experience. Spirit had to teach somebody. Uh, somebody had to call on the most high recover recovery from some illness. We got health out here two times too. Um, somebody had to pray for healing or something like that. Um, I 
Maybe this person feels weak during recovery. If this person had to recover from something. Moving from turbulence or something like that, Aries. Indecision. Somebody felt like they was being reckless. Maybe they got sick or somebody was being negligent. Um, they didn't keep up with their health or something like that. Careless. Um, irresponsible to trusting of somebody. Maybe they was living a single life or something like that. Fear of change, disaster, something happened. Um, mm -mm. Avoiding a disaster. Somebody's trying to self-sufficient they feel like they need some more energy i guess see themselves some type of strength maybe some type of love that you were looking for a reason somebody was self-absorbed um i don't know this shit can hurt you or something like that maybe you kept traveling with this person being i guess the best of this person i don't feel like this person could have returned none of that shit somebody lived a double life around you though aries and that shit is crazy Cause it's the honesty that is trying to change you, and maybe you, you know, this realization too, seeing some shit, suffering, worrying, maybe you know when your intuition was some told you push you, trying to push you for something. Maybe y'all praying to have y'all health restored within a year. I don't know, guys. Somebody's causing for faith or something like that. Five close in reverse. I'm almost burying something. Whatever this information is, new beginning. Somebody want to create something, but it might be too late. It's how they feel. And table resonate. And I always leave the rest. What's up with the love, speed? What's up with the love, the Aries? Who's spirit? Ooh, I got a clear in this energy. I got a sad. What's up with Aries, spirit? Yeah, addiction, codependent, obsession, possession, controlling, has block restraint. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody was dealing with some type of addiction that you were dealing with, Aries, or something. Or maybe you was addicted to love or to some fake ass mask. Um, not showing true feelings, pretending, gaslight, somebody pretending like they love them, not enough. They got you feeling like you, or you might got this person feeling like that. And the Grim Reaper, I knew this shit was going to come out. Spirit! That's why I paused on the code. They said the Grand Reaper. Oh my God. Ooh. Mm -mm -mm. The relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life, Aries. Okay. Stab in the back. Heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack, clock. They go to clock again. Need time heal to heal, time to progress. Ooh. Okay, what's up with the money for the Aries series? I can go. I don't like these. <laughs> what's mm, Queen, Queen of All um, Moons? That's your energy, independence, determined, beauty. Somebody's feeling like they're going to need to get their beauty bag, or they will, or they feel good, better by themselves, or something like that. Or somebody took away their beauty. Or somebody will be taking away their beauty, taking away their independence, or something like that. Um, deception. Somebody be lying about something. Um, their stability. I don't know if you're gonna be trusting somebody, thinking somebody gonna somebody might try to control another person's money or something. Somebody is a narcissist, controlling, like a discipline. Um, maybe you try to build something, new beginning. Somebody will uh manifest a new beginning or healing if they heal. It's like a second chance on life, maybe changing their um, whatever, learning new skills, upgrading themselves, changing businesses or something like that, careers. But then you got somebody going to be trying to control that shit or somebody might be controlling that. You know, death, damn spirit, nine of cups, prosperity, wishes coming true, triumph. Somebody's going to make it hard. Um, the ten of wands, or they, that's something, losing something that... I don't know. Keep the bucket. Ooh, spirit. When realization be kicking in, let me get the hell on up out of this energy. Close this eye. What the hell, spirit? Give me a message for the every side go. Y'all be, be fucking with me. 
I was like, oh my God. Spirit said it ain't so. Give me a call for the Aries I can go. Damn, y'all just hot that one out. It's okay. Dearest Aries, we have a secret for you. The more you think you know, the less you actually do. So if you're willing to keep an open mind, you will avoid the narrow confines of the know-it-all. What? And open up to the unlimited potential that can be disco discovered only by the curious optimist. Curiosity allows you to discover new things, see the world from a different perspective, and find answers to questions you might not even know you have. Right now, whatever is going on, it's important to know that you are not aware of all aspects of it. You need to see to make an informed choice. You might be projecting a story that isn't totally true. So moving forward, your mantra could be, I don't know, or that's interesting. As you keep your mind and heart open to new experiences and, and, and a richer experience, existence overall, all of us over here want you to be all that you can be. Okay? We are cheering you. We're cheering for you. Can you hear us? Aries. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. 